feels weird. Why am I at a weird angle? I should never move my camera ever again. That was just... Mm. Let me tell you the day I had, Dad. Let me just tell you. I slept all day. I slept all day and that's all you need to know. But how are you doing today, Dab? I hope your day's going pretty good. How's life? How's the world? Over here. There we go. That's better. I know I slept all day. Not really. I slept for a little bit. Um, and then I worked on making thumbnails for YouTube. Where's my thing? Here it is. Couldn't find it. Mm. Where is my thing at? That's definitely not it. I didn't think anybody because wow. I could never, I mean, I could, but I forced myself to get up. You know, I woke up at like eight o'clock this morning. I try my best to wake up early. And simply, I get tired in the process. But it's fine. It's okay. But yes. Yes! Lolo, welcome to the stream. How are you? You caught me early. You caught me literally one minute. I've been live for one minute already. Wow. And Dr. my welcome to the stream. How are you? Hope your day's going pretty good. Ooh. Oh, I need to go back somewhere. I gotta scroll through something. You were super lazy and forced myself to work out, do some cleaning, and then work on the shell. That's good. I haven't worked on the shell in a hot minute. It's been a minute since I've worked on the shell, but I'm glad that you worked on it though. Okay, weird. Where's my thing at? I can't find it. Oh, it hasn't been that long. Oh, your hard family came in so I can play, so I got cottage living. Nice! Cottage living! I love cottage living. It's my favorite pack. I've been dabbling into, um, minecraft lately and let me tell you i had one of my friends give me or send me a bunch of like cottage core mods for minecraft and i've been having fun and i'm thinking of making a cottage core build in minecraft soon for a video um but yeah i've been very excited but yay congratulations and cassie welcome to the stream how are you doing today i hope your day's been pretty good uh, you're excited for the shell because I'm doing something I have never done before. Oh, care to explain? Hmm. Care to explain what that might be? Ah. Hello, Robota. Wait, wait. Wait. Robotica, Robotica, Robotica. Six, welcome to the stream. <laughs> How are you? Um, I get an advert for Beyond Meat Chicken Nuggies. What? Beyond Meat? Wait, for McDonald's? Do they have those? Interesting. I've never heard of this before, but yes, today we are going to be playing some BitLife Controls My Sims again because it's been a hot minute since I've last played. It's literally been like 10 days, so it's been a lot. A and W. Wait, what's A, what's a and W? I don't know what that is. Wait, no, I don't know what that is. <laughs> My sister just told me our dad downloaded TikTok. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> He's in for a wild ride. Let the For You page be toxic and confusing. But you should make a TikTok with him, though. You should do it, Dab. Honestly, you should. Boy. 40 with how many kids? So if you don't remember the last stream that we did for Bit Life Controls My Sims, I am on Generation 2. And I have seven kids and I'm only 40. So I'm sad because I have literally too many kids and it's just kind of wild and kind of sus and I don't like it one bit. I'm trying to type something, but I can't figure out what I'm trying to spell. 
here. Oh, that's definitely not it. There we go. Uh, it's a chain restaurant like McDonald's. Probably so. I've never heard of A and A and W before. Today was your first day of school. Ooh, how did it go? How did it go with um the first day of school? I real I looked at my school schedule the other day, and I don't go back to school until October 18th. And I only need one class because I just do. I mean, I've already graduated and everything, but I decided to go back to school again because I'm bored. I literally am just bored sitting here at home doing the constant thing over and over like YouTube, Twitch, repeat, repeat. I need some structure in my life. So I'm going back to school for two months to get a certificate and because I can. Um, <laughs> Oh, but I'm glad you're doing really good, Cassie. Thank you for asking. I'm glad you're doing good. I'm glad you're doing good. Not only 40 with seven kids. Let me tell you, every single time we tried to like stop, just kept on popping up babies. And I'm like, I'm not, this is not the 100 baby challenge. No, 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 not the 100 baby. No, thank you. Um, Where is my, here it is um and robotica thank you so much for the two months i really appreciate it so so much can we get some hype and some love in the chat please and thank you for that brand new resub and daft daft welcome to the stream how are you um it was pretty good my schedule is pretty confusing i feel like every time you go back to school the schedule is like what is this i don't understand what this school schedule is it makes no sense someone please explain so I feel you on that part, honestly. I'm not, whenever I went back to school, I, I was never mentally prepared for like anything for like school, but I don't know what it is, but somehow I, I go to school or like the day before school starts, I have this weird dream that I'm walking through the halls, knowing where I'm going. And the next day I wake up, I go to school. I'm like, this is deja vu. And like, I've been here before. It, it's, it's, it's definitely very weird on, um, I don't know. It's crazy. It is crazy. Oh, thank you. Sending positive vibes your way. Thank you. I, I honestly, I need it. I really need it. I've been struggling mentally these past few months. So yeah, I've been taking breaks as you all know these past few like weeks and stuff, but mentally I'm like, it's a roller coaster, honestly. Um, and biology, biology, babe, thank you so much for the two months reset as well. Thank you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. I may not be here a lot, but I do. I do kind of work here and there. And, you know, hey, I appreciate the lurk either way. I appreciate it. And good. The weekend was needed. Yes. I didn't stream on Saturday and I'm like, I need a weekend break. I need to rest. <laughs> and I slept all weekend. So, Yeah. But good evening, biology babe. How are you doing today? Uh, the school dream is scary. The campus is huge and they just remodeled, so I have no clue where to go. Oh, yeah. See, what's crazy is that my old college, my old university, they're remodeling one of like the wings in one of the buildings. And I'm like, what's going on? What do you mean? I don't understand. Um, is this his work? It does work. Okay, okay, good. Um, Princess Peach, thank you for the resub for 16 heckin' months. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I am a girl. <laughs> and Cassie, thank you for the tier one sub. I really appreciate it so, so much. Hey, 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 friends. Cross stitching. Are you a sim? Death, are you, are you saying what you're saying? You're a sim? Are you a sim? Really? Is that what you're saying? Must be him. <laughs> um, anyway, um, self-care is, is very, very important for sure. I agree. Oh, biology, babe, thing for the, for the two gifted subs to Adam and Red Rosie. I hope you enjoyed the, for the emotes, my friends. Mm -hmm. Maybe interesting. Mm -hmm. Interesting. <laughs> And a welcome on in, friendos. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty great because we're in for a roller coaster of a ride of having seven kids at 40 years old. Ah, what a lovely time. Am I right, kids? Or am I right? 
I'm just string them at a you stream at a perfect time so I just doing my homework nice nice we love that we love that it's a great time yay I remember I used to have homework and I didn't like any of it I never enjoyed homework to be honest ah oh hello oh gosh I broke something ah I broke something ah what is this hold up okay there we go I broke something <laughs> as per usual I don't know what I just broke your positive is incredible thank you so much I appreciate it what did I just I don't know what I did oh okay there we go clary clarity welcome to the stream how are you doing today I hope your day is going pretty good I clicked on something and then I broke something um per usual where did it go here it is I found it I found it <laughs> where did it go what's this what is this poor anyway um my mods you know what you know what I just you know what I just saw you know what I just read Look at the the requests. <laughs> I'm laughing because what they said was rude. Um <laughs> Oh, I know who this is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh not that serious. My life basically. Um, how are you though? I hope your day's going pretty good. I heard good things. Yeah, I am Spring Sims. I am Spring Sims, the uh, the yellow obsessed child of the internet on youtube and twitch but my day is going pretty great i was i broke something on my computer and i had to fix it but overall i'm doing pretty great how are you doing and how is your day so far my friends hmm? how are you so let me just give you a lowdown on what happened last time because let me tell you mm -mm -mm. wait a minute hold up hold up wait a minute Okay, is this one? Okay, good. Let's load that in. There we go. So we're playing BitLife Controls My Sims today. And let me just say that my BitLife life has become very chaotic in the past recent um weeks. <laughs> and it's not so great, but you know, life. And biology babe thing for the 150 bits. I appreciate it so so much. Thank you, thank you. Phone's dirty um wonderful thanks to me nice to meet you yeah nice to meet you as well and welcome on in i appreciate the company um it's been a minute since i've joined it has been a minute pale how you been lately how you been yeah my child angel he passed out because he's always tired and never sleeps which is sad um but what can you really do about it he's a teenager teenagers are always sleepy um but what was i saying oh yeah so the last time that we played, um, we are now 14, we're 40 years old, 40 years old, might I add. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven children at 40 years old. Um, one husband, mother is dead, father is dead, stepfather is dead. We only have one, actually, oh, actually all of our parentals are gone. And we just have one stepbrother, sadly. We are in the business career as an operation analyst. It's just been one of those days. A very long, stressful, you know, life in bit life. So it's just like, mm, what can you do? What can you do? Uh, you've been busy, but better how about you? I've been better. Mentally, I've been, you know, roller coaster, but I've been taking some breaks in between and self-care so i've been pretty good for now but yeah anyway i just came in to say hi and drop a follow gotta get going yeah yeah totally thank you for being here and enjoy the rest of your day appreciate it so much and thank you for the hype train as well i really appreciate it thank you thank you i got a new emote too which is very interesting what's this one mm, i feel like they should get better hype train emotes just be real here okay so what was it oh yeah so our son's in marketing he's studying university our daughter graduated our other daughter is mid middle school we've just paid for our daughter's tuition we 
we're just like, we're simply just at a standstill of nothing right now for like our life and bit life. It's more of a casual thing now. But you know, hey, hopefully we don't get pregnant anytime soon because I simply can't and will not have more kids because I simply am overwhelmed. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know what to say about this. Sir, can you go tend to your, your sibling? Thank you. Thank you. Tend to your sibling. They're tired and over stressed like everybody else. New sibling. Where, where? Where, where? Uh, Hobie, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day's going pretty good. How are you? Chaos question mark? Yes. At this point, all these kids are going to age up and move out of the house. So all we have left is Angel. And then we have Emmanuel over here. And then we have Anna Annalise, who is contemplating life right now with her blonde bleached eyebrows with brown hair. She's asking like, why am I here? Please, can I leave? That's her life, not mine. And then we have our other newborn baby, Edwin. Edwin. <laughs> oh, I've never seen this before. What is this? Oh no, it's fine. All fine, I'm finally home. The, the Oh, back to my PC. Very good, very good. But I'm glad that you're back. I love chaos and sneeze. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty good. I've never seen this pop up before. It says going over some routine expense reports. Adriana notices, notices some lines that don't seem to match up. Upon further investigation, she discovers that a lot of money is being funneled into some secretive executive accounts. Adriana doesn't have doesn't have much standing at the company yet, but this seems like the kind of thing that she should take to the authorities, right? Hmm. What if we just lose our job? Hmm. I don't know. Which one should I do? Like, should I lose the papers or like, should I turn it all over? Which one should I do? Because I'm like, hmm, neither one could happen. And Ariana Artist, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day's going pretty good. How's the world? How's the life of living in the world? Thank you so much, M. I appreciate it so much. The first one. Hmm. I mean, we'll lose our job anyway. We'll probably just get another one at some point. I say just, you know, let's let's do. Oh, that's Paramount Plus. Hmm. Hmm. I could lose them. That's true. Hmm. Now let's see what happens. What? Well, that was boring. I thought I was going to get like some type of notification or something that nope, nothing. Uh, what can you say? What can you say? Uh, do you want to keep him working on some art? Ooh, what kind of art you have you been working on lately? And uh, Crocs, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty good. How's life? How's the world? How are you? But you know, hey, I've been pretty good. I've just been like taking it easy these past couple of days. Mentally, roller coaster, but you know, taking it one day at a time to like relax more. I've been pretty good. Yeah. Mm hmm. But let's go ahead and age up in bit life and see what we get here. We are 40 years old. We have a new heirloom we can look for, actually. What's this? Ooh, a microscope for 2,000 simoleons. Let's age up. Sounds risky. Surprise me. Oh, I turned it down. Whew, that's scared. Uh, working on character design for a comic idea and digital portrait. Ooh, that sounds fun. Ooh, exciting. Okay, let's see. Let's age up again. Max, your supervisor at United Financial Support sponsoring a team building sure i'll go why not okay whatever with my seven children like i don't have what can i say what can i say um cassandra welcome to the stream 
I'm doing pretty good today. How are you though? I hope your day is going pretty good. And the coaster, welcome on in. Yeah, we are playing BitLife Controls My Sims. I'm 40 years old. Well, now 41 with seven kids. Seven. We, I mean, technically four of them are still in the house. The other three are, you know, out and about doing college and whatnot. Our son, Sebastian, is 22. He's still in university. So it's like, we're all at a standstill, to be honest. Surprise me. So nothing of the sort. So we're just gonna go ahead and add how much? 12,900 and seven dollars added on in there we go perfect <laughs> but i hope your day's going pretty good though let's age up i sold stuff why does my friend contessa hate me mm, i'm gonna insult you called you a floozy i'm gonna spend time with everybody okay let's go ahead and age up a little bit more my son has diarrhea why you know, let her go. Be best friends with Florence. What's with all the violence these days? Do you realize that your coworker Samantha has been was able to log into your email account and she can't she sent a chain email to all the staff? Why? Report her. I really want to quit my job so badly. I swear this game is insane. Oh. My son is cured. I swear. This game is just all over the place. I can't really do much in bit life, to be honest. I feel like I should stir up some drama. Maybe I should get divorced. What's our relationship like with our spouse today? What's our oh, we're pretty good. We're both 43. He's a pilot. Hmm. Seven kids. We've been together for 26 years. Literally half of my life. Half of my life has been spent having children. I swear. Well then, what can you do? This has me wanting me to do some of the same stuff in my game. I really like BitLife. I love BitLife so much. It's one of my ultimate favorite games to play just because by my like it's it's my favorite game to play by myself on my phone. But I've never really done it much a lot in BitLife because I'm like, hmm. What are these alerts? The alerts that you hear. Um, are sound alerts that you can get using your channel points. So if you have, a, I think, isn't it 10,000 channel shook simoleons? Isn't that how much it is? I think so. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, you, people can actually redeem a custom sound alert that they can send me for 10,000 channel points. And that's, you know, redeemable for a whole month. You can always renew it, you know. I say it's fun just to have, you know, to announce yourself in the chat. Wait, oh, my son's going to university. I'm going to disapprove of his major. I'm going to change his mind. Change your mind to biology. He agreed. Oh, pay for his tuition. He did. Ungrateful. Ungrateful. This poor child, not poor child, this lame child here. I asked him to change his major to biology, and then I, I pay for his tuition, and he as a he's not appreciative of me paying $54,000. I'm simply just upset now. Like, really? Really, sir? You're not going to be appreciative of me paying for college? Well, I should have you take out a loan then. <laughs> so rude. So rude. I live on campus. Take out a loan. You do that. Goodbye. Bye bye. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ermager biology. You know, I'm a big fan of science. I love science a lot. It's my favorite language. What was it? My favorite languages. My favorite subject in school was um science. Oh, that's pretty cool. I have 10k. I lurk a lot. Mm, that's very good. You know, I appreciate the lurks, you know. Lurks are pretty good. And Mystic, hello, hello. How are you doing today? And yeah, fold that laundry or load the laundry, which reminds me, I need to load laundry and take my laundry downstairs. 
I'll do that after the stream. Go do my laundry. But have fun. Biologists unite. Ooh, what's everybody's favorite subject? Or yeah, what was everybody's favorite subject in school? Mine was simply, uh, I, I adored science. Every, every bit of science was my favorite. History, no. English, not really. Couldn't tell you. Social studies? See, I was really bad at social studies growing up. Annalise, she, 16? Who are you? Emmanuel, how old are you? You're 11. Edward's five. So 16, 11, and five. Okay. 16, 11, and five. Come on, age up, sweetums. Chop, chop. I gotta do laundry today. I have zero work shirts. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's not good. Oh no. Art or English? I was good at English. Art, however, I was good at it, but I couldn't really do like, you know, traditional art. I could do digital art. That's what I could do, but that's just me. You gotta get to the month for my school social studies department. Oh, fuck me. I never had that, sadly. I never had that. Art, I was so good at, at history, English, and writing. See, I was good at that too, but I wrote nonsense. Oh, he was supposed to be a child. You know what? It's fine. I'm gonna age you down to a teenager, nor a child. Child. There you go. Uh, the different aspects of art and photography. Ooh, I loved photography. Anatomy. See, I couldn't... I'm not a good person when it comes to dissecting things. I was just not that good at it. I was simply just not the best. I will be the person that would write everything down and my partner does all the work, like the cutting and stuff. Math and science. Only had... Only like French language. For the food teacher to be brought, this, brought the class. My teacher never brought food to class. I was so hungry. You're doing a master's in biology, so biology. Okay, you know, you know, can, no turning back now. Um, too late in the game, but you know, hey, keep on going, daff daff. <laughs> biology and chemistry were my favorite, but I've been told I'm a good writer. Mm. You could always write a biology chemistry book. Something about that, maybe. Oh, he got promoted. Ooh, who got promoted? Did she get... Who are you? Oh, that's Tyrone. Wait, level six. Level two. Oh. <laughs> Genetics and microbiology. One thousand... One million percent. Mm -hmm. I wish I had more time for photography. I used to do it all in high school. So did I. And I just never got around to doing it as like, you know, fully doing it. I just kind of like dibbled and dabbled into it. So I feel like I should get back into it at some point, but I don't know when I should. I think English was my favorite only because I loved my English teachers I had. And that's a good thing. Our mother's calling us from the dead. Edwin? Edwin. Sure. Come over, son. Why not? You don't see this like school as a whole. I think you can't hate lunch. That now, lunch, lunchtime is a subject. They say it's not, but in reality, it actually is a subject. Get in there. You'll learn a few things about what you want to eat that day, you know? Yeah. A lot of, uh, of course, because I liked, because of the teachers. Hmm. You have to learn an aspect of school and not much of the school social aspect. Yeah, I was the same. I didn't really, it depended on what subject I was in. And what I was doing and where I was at at the time. Like high school. Didn't like any of this like the whole schooling aspect at all. It was awful. I didn't hate I hated it the whole time. Um also it was just a lot. Also, Mystic, I don't think I ever said thank you for the reset for one heckin' year. Hmm. I'm gonna replay that. Here we go. Thank you for the 12 month for the 12 month resub, Mystic. I don't know how I missed that. My brain was going loopy. Um, I'm thankful I got to study traditional photography. Would you say that's like a good like traditional photography is a 
good way to learn photography if you didn't have an experience. As long as she's not asking her son to come. Oh my gosh. Let's hope not. Okay. Let's go and age up some more. Let's make some friends, shall we? Oh, I think for... Wait, who's the youngest in this household? Edwin? He's five. You know... We'll see how... I'm gonna see how long we last in this bit life life because I've, I've wanted to try out the... Um, become like a famous singer in um, bit life, but also in The Sims with Get Famous. I'm like, I wanna try that out and see what works. Cause that'll be very fun to try out a different lifestyle. Cause this will be generation three that will be on after we um, die in bit life. And who knows when that will be. Julia, I'm gonna report you. I feel like I'm gonna get fired at some point. Have a talk with Emmanuel. Yes. My son has tonsillitis. Yay. I guess lunch was my favorite, my fave then. Although I love Coop. Oh, co-op. See, I was supposed to do co-op and was like, yeah, I couldn't do it. Between show choir, choir, and magicals, and like all my other extracurricular activities, I could not do co-op. I physically and emotionally could not do co-op. Good. Um, but there was, they had to have a placement in, in a job to learn the different aspects of the potential career. Does that make any sense? Yeah, I used to, I had co-op in school, but I never did it. A lot of times I liked my history and my art teachers. They were always so chill. Sixth grade art teacher made me realize I wouldn't pursue art seriously. And look at you now. Look what you're doing now. Mm -mm -mm. And yeah, I was in choir. I was in choir, show choir, madrigals. Um, I was never really in a musical per se because I was never really good at you know, acting. But I simply was just there. Um, I think learning photography in traditional manners is a lot more fun and worth it if you've got the chance. Oh, cool. Hmm. What parts? I was a soprano, alto, and tenor. Those were my parts of choir. Um, well, sixth grade. No, seventh grade, I was like soprano, alto. I was all three parts, basically. And then high school, I was tenor one the entire time. Tenor won the entire time of my high school career. I still am. <laughs> I just have a naturally high voice. My voice doesn't go deep. I just have a very natural high voice. That's how I live. Child, what are you doing? Edwin. Can I um, discipline you? Parenting. Um, discipline. Strict. Yell and make a mess. Do it. No, oh, that's why I want to be an art teacher to help little weird kids like me realize they got to practice art to get good. Yes. Yes. I agree. Practice makes perfect. Why does she look so disappointed? <laughs> she looks so disappointed in her own child. It's like, what are you doing? Please stop. Don't even, don't you even dare put another paint on the floor. I swear. If you do, you're grounded. <laughs> this looks so funny. Uh, <laughs> you were a second soprano. I feel like with being a tenor and then like no soprano, it's like we do all the work, but then there's altos who also are like the backbone. You're like, they're like altos are like, are like the middle, middlemen of, of choir. And I'm like, why? We simply do too much work and have to hit those high notes. Oh, there was a time in my seventh grade. Yeah, seventh grade year. Um, we sang Phantom of the Opera and that was a time and a half. Let me tell you that. Singing Phantom of the Opera was fun, but so much work. Sir, if you are going to live here, you need to shower. Because you're smelly. Smelly. And then my 12th grade year in choir, we all went to, not all, people who could pay for it and had time to go. We all, my choir teacher, I almost said aloud. 
got us, got us to the point where we could perform at Carnegie Hall. And that was pretty cool. So I performed at Carnegie Hall and that was really like the top of like my list, like my wish list of being a singer to perform at Carnegie Hall. And I did at 18 years old. It was the best time in my life. 36 songs, might I add, because I was in like the top, like top, top choir. And there was like the selected choir, then the all choir thing. And so it was like 36 songs in total. I was dying afterwards, um, but it was worth it. You wish you could ground kids in game. You technically can. So if you have, um, where does it go? Oh, I don't have it in here. If you have parenthood, you actually can. It need, you need to get the bulletin board to do that. Because I don't really know if you can do it with like the actual like interaction interactions. But I know that you can do it with um, the bulletin board if you have parenthood, like set curfews and stuff. But it only happens when kids like do something bad. I was like, what is he doing? I love Phantom of the Opera. What was funny is the figuring out, finding out that the person who played Christy played on, um, was it that 70s show? No, it almost said Scandalous too. Shameless. I thought that was very interesting to find out. I'm like, oh, wow. Oh, the tables have turned. What do you mean you can still be right now? I know, isn't it wild? My goal in life to have my art in New York City a gallery show. I was like, just like Max Caulfield from Life is Strange. Um, you've done some small upstate New York gallery shows before, but you got to go through tears approval of New York ones. Yeah, you do. And it's like, it's a, a lot for sure, but it's totally worth it at the end. I'm going to restart this. Is it done? What? You know what? Sell it. Sell it. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. I didn't know that until I started watching Shameless and that show is a lot. I have so much stuff in here. I wish there was like a sell all button or something because that would be making it so much easier. I think what they should do, yeah. Have a sell all option in your household inventory because this is annoying. Oh, I'm done. Oh, so in order to do that, you, so, okay, what's, what's, what's that, what's Twitch? With YouTube, what they did, this, like, COPA thing with, like, YouTube and kids and everything, um, you need to go into your YouTube settings and set it to where your videos are not safe for children, because that way you can have the comment section back in your videos, even though, like, your, your, your videos might be safe for kids, um, make sure that they're not, the setting is set, not safe for kids. So you can have a comic section, if that makes sense. Um, I don't know. Oh, I was just pressing my delete key the entire time. Holding down my delete key and just pressing each item. Though it goes faster. Um, but yeah, make sure you go into your YouTube settings, uh, that grow my, and have it set, not safe for kids. Cause that's what I do. Cause that way you can get comments again and you can get feedback and all that stuff. YouTube's jacked up. Let me tell you ever since YouTube realized that some videos are not safe for kids, like, um, those weird gotcha videos, um, they turn for the worse. And then there was also like some weird, like, I don't know when this happened, but it was like so long ago where YouTube, um, was like, in a standstill and things were happening and like there was like this one video or like a few videos that were being uploaded to youtube for so long that looked like a kid's like video but in reality it actually wasn't a kid's video and things were happening people were getting ads out of it and then it was just like not it people at youtube was using losing advertisers then they had to change their policy and then like you could get sued if you had if you didn't um you know rate your video correctly so it was like it was a whole thing youtube was just extra but you know things are now better now that they have an option where you can set your entire channel not safe for kids because my channel is family friendly both on youtube and twitch but like youtube sims is not family friendly in 
many different ways and the games that i play are family friendly but i'm like i'm trying to not get sued or you know trying not to i want feedback i need feedback on my videos so i know how i'm doing you know it was it youtube was just a weird thing right dinosaur it's crazy yeah your youtube yeah your videos might be safe for kids for children but comments may not be exactly but let me tell you, there was a time where it happens every now and then for me where I get like random spam comments and I just end up reporting and deleting them afterwards. But yeah, comment, the comment section in YouTube videos are toxic sometimes. So be aware of that. It can pr get pretty hectic. Did you not learn from the last time, Edwin? Edwin, why? Did you not learn from your mistake? This child's like, I'm going to be evil for the rest of my day with no pants on. Like, okay, this child is too much. And then he proceeds to play in the toilet. He's dirty. Can we show some mod love in the chat, everybody? Can we spam some hearts in the chat, please? Thank you. And also, Sarah, how are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty good. Okay. So we are now 46 years old in bit life and we need to actually get up to maybe age 50. My son is now cured from tonsillitis. I'm going to let you go, Mira. I'm going to let you go too. I don't want to be depressed. While on a trip to the mall, a volunteer called you a, a tart. What? I don't know what that is. I'm going to insult you. What? Call the police. <laughs> got busted. She got arrested. Overtime. Thank you. I swear, there's a lot of things happening here. And I'm just like, what is going on? Crazy. Ugh, my child is like out of control in bit life and in Sims. I'm also very smelly. I don't know why my child was playing in the toilet. They simply are just overwhelming. So, Annalise is 20. You gotta kick her out. Emmanuel is 15. Edwin is 9. So, Annalise, she gotta go. Annalise gotta go. I gotta age up. Um, ma'am, time for you to wake up and get out of my house. Chop, chop. Come on. Don't be shy. Remove from Emily. Bye. You know what's great about this, about today? I'm not having any more kids. I had seven children. And I'm just like, no more, please, just no more. Look at this family tree. It's crazy. Our aunt is still alive. Hold up, what? Our family tree is like, it's crazy. Seven kids. Yeah, you're doing well. We had our inspection of the condo and there were a few minor things, but everything checks out so we're most like gonna move in about a month Ooh, exciting that's so exciting are you are you are you prepared are you like mentally and physically prepared for that right now like has it sinked in that you're moving in like a month child stop playing in the nasa toilet you are disgusting he's also very inquisitive which does not help his case whatsoever so i'm like child please stop don't play in the toilet that's where all the germs are at. I don't like it. I'm gonna age him up anyway. Edwin might be generation three, but a part of me wants like a surrogate. I don't know, maybe. We'll have to say child. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> I'm looking for bits right now in Wayfair. I hear Wayfair is really good. <gasps> Look at Edwin, he looks so cute. <laughs> I want to give my Sims a makeover real quick because I haven't done that in a hot minute. But Wayfair, I've been looking at furniture too. And I've been waiting for like this call or like this email because apparently I'm, I'm, I'm the, apart the apartment, but the house that I applied for, I'm still waiting to hear back. I've heard nothing. Zilch, not a nothing. So I'm like, did I get it? Did I not get it? Like, let me know if I got the house or not so I can move on to better, bigger and better things. Like, getting the apartment that um is also great. So, I'm like, I'm just waiting at this point, you know? 
uh, because we need a bigger bed, but we're getting, uh, we're going to get my twin in the second bedroom slash office. Oh, good. So thankful my IRL kids don't, have not done that. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, because toilets are, the toilets are nasty, disgusting. Sometimes they don't clean them. And like, why don't you clean the toilets? You know? Uh, you have a bed with drawers from the storage and these lucky. I wish I had those. I wish I had drawers under my bed. Then I'll have more storage for all my clothes. I barely have any room in my closet, you know? Oh, to answer your question about the shell, I'm having a sorority for Foxberry. I'm making a sorority for Foxberry and I'm actually having fun with it. Ooh, exciting. Yeah, so the shell challenge is officially up now, if you didn't know. I've uploaded it to the gallery a couple of days ago, actually. Um, it's an abandoned home with style. And the key thing is that you have to restore it to its former glory, like renovate it, like change the roofing, the layout on the inside, like change up everything. It's a hot mess that needs desperate help. So um, please fix it. Please. But yeah, it's under the hashtag Spring Fixer Upper, or you can like search my gallery ID, either one. Uh, so exciting opening up a game for the first time since college. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so excited. What's the first thing you're gonna do now that you can play The Sims and everything? <laughs> it's like a whole new world. <laughs> my bed right now is a bed with drawers and these. Oh, I wish I had one of those. A part of me wants one like that, but then I'm like another part of me is like, yeah, no, I would probably break it. So no bed like that for me for the long time. For a very long, long time. Maybe this one. There we go. But that's a really cool idea though, Dab. My parents just applied to move into a really nice house. I'm excited about that. Uh, I'll be giving my brother all my furniture and buying my own. Ooh, exciting. What's the first thing you're gonna buy? Any ideas? And I feel like as soon as you get like your own place or like you move out, you become excited about the most littlest things ever like toilet paper or like new sheets for your bed or like kitchen appliances or, or like utensils for your like your skillet or whatever. You, it's like as soon as you move out, it's like you become excited about the most simplest little things ever. Not getting money. No, no, not that. Toilet paper and sheets for my bed. <laughs> like, okay. I guess that's my life now. But no, I get very excited about like the most simplest things nowadays. It also has sleeves in, in the headboard. What? You can then get a queen with storage. It is, but it's so much more expensive than the ones without it. So I might get plastic storage containers to fit underneath. I mean, that's smart. A trip to the container store does does make it help. A trip to the container store is an exciting time. Let me tell you, when I get my apartment or my house, either one that I get, best believe I'm gonna go to, to, con go to the container store and buy so many bins for my pantry. Not even gonna be even funny, it's gonna be worth it. My bed, oh, my bed opens up and there's a whole open space underneath where you can sit and vibe. What? Hogwarts? Oh, when did we do the new shell? I think the new shell was like, when was this? I think it was on Thursday. Yeah, it might've been Thursday when I posted it on the gallery. Cause we did shell tours that one day and then we ended up doing um the new shell the next day on that Thursday. And yeah, enjoy the rest of your day, biology babe. Thank you for being here. Appreciate the company. Have fun with life. Uh, I have a nice bed frame and I've been looking at shelves because I want to feel like I live in a library as one should. Oh, Garrett, how are you? Welcome on in. I hope your day's going pretty good. How's life? How's the world? How's Fallout 4? going for you how's it how's it been going for you mm -hmm. i was thinking about having my own toilet paper today oh buy your own toilet paper isn't that exciting 
because like you get to look you get to search at all the new like aisles and like okay i want this one i want that one like, that one's more softer or, like that one's like has more more like um paper sheets or whatever it i'm telling you once you buy your own stuff it's like it's exciting crazy exciting he looks handsome um you went to the supermarket by myself a few days ago and i have a sense of accomplishment felt nice that's good i think when i bought i literally bought a whole tv like i bought a new tv that's sitting in my room in a box it's like i think it's 43 inches i bought a 43 inch flat screen tv <laughs> off of amazon i bought a smart tv 43 inches it's just sitting there i bought an air fryer slash pressure cooker a tea maker it was just a great time buying things on your own is just wonderful life is scary yes i agree because that's why i don't leave my house i feel you i feel your pain less than a week from moving Ooh, woo. are you excited for moving day you know what garrett what you should do you should vlog your adventures you should vlog you going to school like moving from your parents house to your dorm that's something that, that's something that you should do honestly i'm just saying life of a college freshman mm -hmm. the college living clothes are so cute they are i i love college living so much because of the clothes like this is my dream cottage core pack of all time and then dream home decorator is my favorite interior design pack of all time so i'm like they did a good job on this pack i'm just saying excited and scared mm. you should vlog chop chop garrett we want the vlog content content baby content give me the gimme 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 get give me the videos i want to see the videos i keep telling him to do those things i think he should stream from dining hall yes 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 i agree be like rory gilmore yeah well not like her because she was she went on a downward spiral from like the very start she got in and the way she left don't be like her she was crazy um after her freshman year but you know yeah vlogging Bear Bear, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty well. How's the life? Be a worry, but high school worry. Yes. Yes. I, ha I had to think for a quick second. I'm like, wait, what happened in high school for Rory? Yeah. Be like Rory, but high school worry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Are you gonna have a room? Unfortunately, ugh. Does that mean no streaming from your dorm room then, Garrett? Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're saying, Garrett? What if I just stream from your dorm room? What if I just like barge in and like I start streaming, like when you're not there? Yeah. It's like barge in. And I start streaming from your computer in your dorm room and you walk in and saying, what are you doing? Like, I'm streaming. Duh. What else would I be doing? Hmm. <laughs> Going back to work today and very simply, hopefully work wasn't too crazy for you today. Hopefully it wasn't. Was it hot where you are? Because it literally rained about an hour ago. And I'm just like, it's getting hotter by the second. Uh, we'll probably stream on Thursdays and Fridays. Okay, that's good. I mean, Maggie, she's going back to school, so you can always ask her. Or Christian. One of the two. Because, I mean, they're going to be sophomores and you're going to be a freshman, but you know. <laughs> Please do. Okay, just give me the address and I'll show up. Okay. <laughs> I'll just, I'll just walk in. Just give me the address and I'll be there. Don't worry. I'll surprise you by not surprising you. You want rain? You don't want the rain that I just got. It was just 
daunting. It was just not wonderful. I wanted to leave. It just came out of nowhere. I'm like, what's happening here? Like, I don't understand. Oh, wait, I can give her... Ooh. Is this base game? How was this base game? I've never seen this before. I've never seen these outfits, outfits before and apparently they're base game. I don't understand, but they look great though. Madam Secretary. This looks so cool. I guess that means you gotta play with the careers to get the new outfits, apparently. Because I've never seen this before. It hasn't rained in here forever. It rained like... It was like 50% chance of rain, so... It's supposed to rain tomorrow and the next day for like the next three days. I've been trying to tell him just learn. Uh, learn his roommate's schedule. Yeah, see, honestly, when I was in university, um, when I lived on campus for that one year, I streamed just because I wanted to. But I was so nervous at first because it was like a new environment and with like people around me that I didn't know. So it was very scary. But as I... Did it more, I was like, I was comfortable and I didn't care who was around. What is on her face? What is this? Glasses? Earrings? What? Looks like something they wear to work. Maybe it's a business here. Probably so. Because I was like, I've never seen it before. But it does look pretty snazzy. I don't know. Is it her outfit, maybe? It might be her outfit. Oh, that's fine. Now, where is Cottage Living? Must be up here somewhere. <laughs> Aha! Here it is. Cottage Living. Ah. Nice, flowy dress. Cottage core. Love it. Probably face details. Oh. Oh, no, it was the outfit. That was the issue. The outfit was the problem. Oh, okay. So that's all we got there for us. I just wanted to make over my two Sims. Let me tell you, these outfits are wild. Wild. <sighs> okay, anyway. So how old, are, how old are we in bit life? I don't remember. We are 48 in six months. I'm gonna age up. Ad trap. Click through all the 100 ads. Me and Tyrone have been married for 20 years. My son Roberto has been diagnosed with itchy bottom. My son Angel graduated from university, was an undergrad in, in biology, and he said a graduate school. <gasps> That's so cool. Any grandkids yet? No. I got no grandkids. How am I supposed to continue the legacy with no grandkids? Huh? Attacker, I don't care. Oh. <laughs> oh no. I I killed my coworker with a roundhouse kick and she died. I'm gonna cooperate with them. Watch me not go to jail for five years. Watch me not go to jail. Not guilty. Oh, um, well, off the prison. Off the prison then. Time to quit my job. How do I quit my job? Oh, go to my phone. I've been convicted with manslaughter in bit life. I'm off to jail now. Sadly, I'm reckless. <laughs> Minimum security though. True. For five years, I could escape. I could plead my... I can play my bargain, right? I got enough money for that, right? Yeah. You were playing Stardew earlier and I found a cosmetic shard uh, in the Skull Cavern and then I wasn't paying attention and so I died. Oh my gosh. And 12 spicy eels. That's not good. And Miss Griffey, how are you doing today? Welcome on in, friendos. I hope your day is going pretty good. Welcome in the Raiders as always, my friends. But Tanya, how is your stream today? What did you all do? I would love to hear all about it, my friend. 
Um, if you're popping on in right now, we are playing BitLife Controls My Sims. BitLife on this side, Sims on the other. We are now going to jail for manslaughter because we killed our co-worker, sadly. Um, they were annoying, so they had to be dealt with, and that's not my issue. So, yeah. What can I say? We're in for a wild ride, honestly. Let's go and... <laughs> Most popular jail. But yeah, welcome on in, friends. But yeah, I've been... We're, on, we're currently on Generation 2 right now of our BitLife Controls, our Sims Legacy Challenge. And if you don't know what this means, whatever we, whatever happens in BitLife, we have to replicate within the Sims to the best of our ability. And BitLife is a free mobile app game that you can download off of the Apple Store or the Google Play Store. Either one. It's the most chaotic game I've ever played on my phone. It's like The Sims, but on steroids and crazier because it goes from 0 to 100. Like, for example, there was one time in my BitLife life where I was 3 years old. I yelled at my sister and then she killed me with a bazooka when she was only 11. What 11-year-old has a bazooka and kills their own sister? Like, what was the reason? So, um, BitLife is chaotic, but totally 100% worth playing if you want to. Yeah. Anyway, um, but yeah, Tanya, thank you again for the raid. I really appreciate it. Yeah, bit life is crazy. Bit life is wild. You should all you all should play it at some point. You should play it at some point. Before to be 30? Yeah, why not? Let's put this down and know with the springs. So we're off to um minimum security jail. Yep. Minimum minimum security jail for five years, but we're going to try and escape. Hopefully I can escape because I want to escape actually because I think, I think it'd be kind of fun. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yeah, I have, I want to show you, um, oh gosh, I want to show you my other bit life, life that I was playing earlier that I'm really, really proud about, honestly, like really proud that I've been playing for many, many months actually, or like two years actually. Um, but I have this bit life life that I've been playing for like, Mm, years on end i'm currently at generation 51 uh years are 2143 years and i've accumulated 1 billion 1.2 billion dollars in bit life this was like my other save that i have in bit life that i play constantly and i make sure i continue on the legacy without any of my characters dying from old age or anything but it's my most progressed bit life life i've ever played and i plan on not stopping at any this at any point so yeah <laughs> but savvy welcome to the stream how are you doing today i hope your day is going pretty great we are going to jail in bit life because simply we got caught <laughs> this says a welcome with a heart how sad it says welcome to jail I hope you enjoy your stay here. Okay, sure. Why not? <laughs> Fine. Um, whatever. But yeah. Tabiko, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty good. How's life for you doing? Oh, I'm going to exit you out there, my friend. There you go. Um, move household out. I'm going to switch these out here real quick. Take you with no money whatsoever. We're living life on the wild side, basically. It's free real estate. Hello? Okay. But yes, welcome on in. Um, we have basically gone from zero to 100 in bit life today. We started out being 40 years old with seven kids. And now we are now basically 50 or 49 years old in jail for five years and still have seven kids but they're all grown up and basically out of the house which is great but what can you really do mm, 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 mm. but yes welcome in tabby co how's your life been today how was work if you went to work today hmm okay i'm gonna find a household but i feel like i should find a household let's do popular now most popular jail oh here we go oh that is scary no Let's see no 
you know, when I look at the gallery from like from the olden days of Sims 4, I questioned I question why and what in the world is happening. I just ask myself that a lot. I'm like, what is going on? The gallery is crazy. I can't locate. What you mean I can't locate? Fine. I will simply just take the women's county jail then. What do you mean? Oh my gosh, this galley's glitch. No, no update on the house yet, sadly. I'm still waiting to get an email or, or something, but I'm being ghosted basically, and it's not great. So I'm just waiting. It's all about a waiting game at this point. Uh, Hopefully I can hear something back soon at some point. Probably tomorrow. I'm going to give them until Wednesday, basically, to respond. If I don't get it by Wednesday, I'm going to assume I didn't get it and apply for the apartment so I can grab it and get it and go. Because I'm trying to have my own space at some point and I want to be able to be an adult. You know? Yeah? But what can I really do? Can't do much. Yes. There we go. But yeah, here's generation two, our sim. Her name is Ari Adriana Ortiz. That's her name. I mean, if I do get it, great. If I don't, that's fine. Because the thing is, it's only like $12.50 a month, but I'm paying for all the utilities, which is like, I don't mind. I don't really care. I don't care if I'm paying for all the utilities, but still, if I don't get it, I don't care. Aww. I mean, it's not the end of the world. I simply just want extra stuff, more space. But if I get the apartment, it's based on the amount of, like the same amount of space. But I'm paying a little bit more. So it's like it's sad, but you know, whatever. Yeah. Work was pretty busy. But at least we close early on Monday. It makes it better to deal with. That's good. That's good. Oh, I did I emailed them yesterday on Sunday, so they should be able to get it at some point. They probably got my email. I followed up with them saying, um, is there any update on the application or any um, process at any point? Here to share. Um, but yeah, I did email them. Yeah, I'm I'm planning on moving next month in September, maybe October, to a new house or an apartment. So crossing fingers. But also, Jordy, how are you doing though? But yeah, so we are in jail in BitLife now. Um we roundhouse kicked our co-worker and we got convicted for manslaughter. Um yeah. <laughs> so we're going to try and escape. Oh, this stuff is a... Oh, no. I honestly hate these BitLife minigames because they're so much work. Go up here. Go down here. No. One more. Now I'm here for six years. you got to be kidding me. Fine. Fine. I'm going to be there for a while now. I'm actually going to have her go down here and talk to some people. Meet some friends. Why not? But yeah, we're in jail now, which is sad. But what can you really do when you're in jail? Nothing. No, that's what you think so much, Jordy. Oh, have you purchased your new computer yet? Anybody, by any chance? Mm hmm Have you? Mm-hmm. Also, the glitch of kids stretching out long legs is back. For you, anyway. Oh, no. <laughs> That's not good at all. I want my breakfast burrito. Give me, give me my breakfast burrito. Thank you very much. Uh, Aaliyah, wait, no. Ali, Alice Unicorn, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day's going pretty good. How's your life been? But I'm doing pretty good today. So anyway, like I was saying, we are now 46 years old. We're 49 years old, and now we're 50, and our son Emmanuel is suffering from acne. And look who wants a divorce. We're gonna end up alone and in jail. We're 50 years old, and now he wants a divorce. What if I beg him to stay? Will he just, like still say no? <laughs> what did I say? I was gonna end up alone, divorce with seven kids, or end up alone with kids 
And look what's happening now. Are you kidding me? Oh, wait, you are worth... Uh oh. What? I have anxiety and I only have 6,000... Oh, my... You've got to be kidding me. What? Ma'am, what, what in tarnation is going to happen over here? Uh-uh, go back down. I swear. Michael, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty well. I'm stressed. This is outrageously insane. We're, we are now divorced. We have seven kids. And we simply are just in, we're now, we're, we're still in jail. So I'm like, <laughs> what? Keep them. I realize that prison is nothing like the movies. Well, you think? You think, can I escape? I would escape. She's very happy, but you know, she's about to be in, she's about to divorce himself soon. I'm going, I'm going to escape. Let's, let's see if we can escape. I'm gonna try this mini game again. This is so. I cannot believe this. All oh, right. Uh. No, it's not gonna work. I'm. Uh, I'm glad you're doing good, Michael. Cause I'm simply am not doing great. It worked in the movies. You were caught to escape from prison. Oh gosh, great. You ran into some issues, so no PC just yet. Hopefully in the next few months. Cross some fingers. Hopefully so. Hopefully so. Uh, and our house got repossessed too. You've got to be kidding me. And now I have depression. And now I am. I'm, oh gosh. What has come to this? <laughs> what in the world? We have. I just keep extending my life in jail. Oh my gosh, you know, what What if, what if, what if, what if we escape again? Let's try, let's try escaping. Let's try escaping and see what happens. Um, okay. You go in here, go right here. I, No. Wait, 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 wait. The bank is repossessing your contemporary home. Oh, I'll be refunded. <gasps> I have money. I have money again. Oh my gosh, I have money. I'm rich. You know, when they repossess your house, you know it's a great day, question mark, in bit life, right? Yeah. Sure. Imagine escaping and having no home. But having... um. $300,000 back from the bank. <laughs> Get swole. Why not? Can I escape again? I can't. Oh, not this one again. You got to be kidding me. What in the world? Okay. I might be in jail, but I have money. Wait. Hi, all. Hello, Cinderella. Welcome to the stream and thank you for the reset for three heckin' months. I really appreciate it so, so much. And now you have a new um, sub badge that's to your name. And you know what I just realized? I can appeal my my sentence. I'm sitting here like, I should escape, but I'm extending myself. No, I'm going to... Overturned! I've been overturned. You know, they simply just know I was I was right and I did not kill my coworker. They were just having a bad day that day and they just simply were like going crazy, you know? I don't know. I've been overturned. I've been overturned. Oh, oh, I've been overturned. I've been overturned. Hey, hey. <laughs> Woohoo. Yeah. Um, still depressed and I still have anxiety, but you know, overturned. I love it when you play Bit Life with The Sims. It's so much fun. We're in jail, but wait a minute. No, we're not anymore. We're not in jail anymore. We simply can leave. We've been overturned, but we have no home to go to. Our house has been repossessed. We're now divorced. 
Um, yeah. <laughs> my sim is an O. My sims are now an O couple and now spending their lifetime together through their loss of a child. Oh, I'm getting the feels and there's no and there was no cheating. Oh, that's so sad. It's like I I feel bad saying this, but I, I like stuff like that. I don't know why. I, I I love family gameplay like that because I get attached to my Sims so easily. But when they get to a point in their life where they lose a kid or they grow old together, I'm like, oh, I love Gillian. it so much. Wait for instruction. Okay, let's leave. Let's leave jail. We've been overturned. We've been overturned. See, oh no 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 no. Hold up. Back up. Back up. Take all my money. Take all my money back. I earned every single cent here today. Yes. Thank you very much. No. We're going to go ahead and take our children with us. Actually, hold up. How's, how old are our kids? Edwin is 13. Eli is, you know, Emmanuel is 19. So we just got to take Edwin. We just got to take Edwin out. So I'm going to take you out. Yeah, I'm going to take you out. Goodbye. With no money. I'm going to go and take you out as well. With no money. Oh. Oops. Hold up. Ah. You not in the world. Go over here. Take all the money. And then you are left alone. Good. Whew. But yes. Yes. Ah, this is great. So I don't know where we can live now. We have to find a place to live in bit life. And on the Sims. We have no house, no grandkids. Our stepbrother is still alive somehow at 58 years old. We're unemployed. We can't get a job because we have a criminal record. So we're ending up alone, homeless, jobless. And it's like, what was the reason? I simply just don't understand. My poor Sim. Anxiety and depression. Seven kids divorced at, at 52 in Edmonton, Canada. Can I leave? Can I go and like emigrate somewhere else, please? I need a fresh new start, please. And thank you. Puerto Rico? No, I've been there. Ireland. Really? Okay, we can go. We now live in Ireland. Hanford on Bagley. Mary Rich. You know, that's possible. We could do that. We can do that. <laughs> Um, I went to jail and I got released in BitLife, so we're now simply um, doing great. So now we move to Hemford on Bagley, maybe. Because isn't, wouldn't you say Ireland is like Hemford on Bagley or Windenburg? Which one would you, which one would you categorize as that one? Windenburg or Hemford on Bagley for Ireland? Um... And maybe we could get a, cr a criminal job in BitLife to see if it works. That is true. Join the mafia? Yes. Live a life of crime. Uh, so a farm in Ireland? Sounds good to me. We have money for it. We can afford a big old plot of land. Okay. Hemford and Bagley it is. Hemford is more English countryside to me. Hmm. What if we just kick out the Watson family? They're chaotic. <gasps> no, we can live over here instead. Live in a big giant house. We're gonna evict you. Bye-bye. Furnished. Thank you. We now live in a new home. Big old mansion that we can now get a mortgage for in BitLife. Yeah, and we can be a criminal as well. So first things first, assets. Our Toyota 4 Runner. We're going to have to give that to one of our children, Edwin. Actually, you know, Emmanuel, you can have this car. He told me I was a genius. Thank you very much. We still have our diamond ring. We're going to go and get this. Oh, it's three million pounds. Oh my goodness. What have I done? You know what? Let's go into the real estate. We're going to go and get this estate mortgage. Oh, insufficient funds. Okay. Well, all right. Let's go and do a colonial house, get a mortgage. What? What you mean? Hold up, wait a minute, wait a minute. You know what? We're gonna simply get a small house, paying cash. I'm just gonna say what we got. We're gonna join the mafia. 
in bit life because that seems reasonable right yeah joining the mafia perfectly normal everybody does it right yeah of course everyone does that simply <laughs> in the mafia deliver packages i joined the mafia in ireland the De, De luca family De Luca, Andrew De Luca, Grey's Anatomy De Luca. So now we're in a mafia associate. We're gonna work very hard, but watch one of my kids die from the mafia. Just I can guarantee it. It's just like uh uh. <laughs> my friend. Uh, I think I made the De Luca family The Sims. Oh, you did you? Ooh. Okay. So our son. Um, Edwin, he is how old? How old is he? Edwin is he's 13. So I'm gonna keep him as a child for now. We are currently how old? We're 52 years old. We're gonna just keep on aging up until we do that. You come home from a bike ride and discover an ace of spades sitting on your toilet. What does that mean? What does an ace of spades mean? You turn around and identify as an associate from the DeLuca family standing in the shadows. Surprise me? I'm gonna die right here. I'm gonna die. I'm going to die. Oh my gosh, watch me die. Oh no, he died. Open. <laughs> well, um, <clears throat> 53 years old. And we are just truly living today. <clears throat> so we're just having a good old fashioned time. Living the life of crime. Doing so great for ourselves, can't you tell? Yeah. I'm gonna contribute to the family. Work the family. There we go. <laughs> uh, yeah, I might go back to jail, but you know, what could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? I don't know. What could happen? <laughs> oh, Ace of Space is a death card. Oh, I did not know that. We're 53. Um, maybe we should marry rich because we're very poor right now. We're very poor. I'm going to go and deduct our money to 70,000. Is that much? Set it to this. There we go. Go to the doctor real quick. Make sure we're healthy and good. Let's see. Love. Dating app. Make sure you're rich, rich. We'll make you like 80 years old. Why not? Mm, why not? Why not? Let's get married. Let's elope. Elope. Refused. Oh my gosh, you know what? Propose. I don't care. Or <laughs> a hit out of you. True. He rejected the proposal. You know what? No, 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 no. No, no, no. Sunset cruise. Propose. Reject. I'm going to end up alone. I swear. Wait, hold up. Pause this game. But your boss, Bow Lake Martina, has ordered you to shake down a local radio show host. Surprise me? What if I just keep on doing surprise me? What will happen? Can I die? Surprise me. Do it with no question. Shake them down. Break the nose. I'm no longer depressed and I no longer, I no longer have anxiety. You know, they say when you join the mafia, it cures your depression and your anxiety. I have proof to tell you all today. It does work. <laughs> Rejection from all angles. Yes. Okay. We're going to appreciate you. Maybe we should also do some more crime extortion of a company. We're going to. Hello. I... There we go. Um, Shake them down. Give me all your money. Thank you. We're going to not report it at all. Just be sneaky. No! And then he died. I should have... I should have... Oh my gosh, he died. He died! I'm gonna end up alone. You know what? Next 
you know, next up. That chance of folks choosing violence cures anxiety. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. It indeed it does. You've heard it here, folks. Go on a date. Why not? Liam. Liam Hensworth. Now, we're going to propose movie theater. Rejection. Hold up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up, sir. Hold up. Hold up. National Park. You know, I'm going to end up alone. I can feel it in my bones. I can feel it in my deep, deep bones. I'm going to end up alone. I'm going to give you no ring. Ferris wheel. He accepts the, the no ring proposal. Okay. Wedding. Golf course. Do it. Prenup. Yes. Keep my last name. Good. We got a new house. We got more money. Perfect. We are now $3 million. Is this the ring size? It might have been the ring size. The ring size was, oh, 0.34 carats. That is not so great. That's, that is small. The plus the quality was actually very bad anyway. Well, hey, what can you do? What can you really do? Well, we have a lot of things we have to do here in The Sims, like divorce our old spouse, first of all. Where is he at actually? Tyrone. Okay, we're going to call him over. Oh, he's right here in front of the door. <laughs> no one, they, they said nothing. This this one's um small. And um we're going to have to change it out to something new. So we're going to divorce Tyrone. Bye-bye. Leave me alone. Go away. Goodbye. So we divorced him. We quit our job because we got fired because we went to jail. We're going to go ahead and join the mafia. The criminal career. Seems reasonable. The criminal career. <laughs> we're living the life of crime. I would say that we're probably level three as a ringleader. Most likely. Very good. We're going to have to go also get a new sim from the gallery to put into our household. We're 55 years old. I've come to realize that happiness is a, is a choice. <clears throat> I've come to realize that happiness is a choice, not a privilege. Okay, let's see. What's his name again? Liam Dunn. Liam, are you here? Liam, don't be shy. How old is he? 59 years old. He could die very quickly. That's fine, right? No? Eh. I wish you could. Let's see. Household slot size. You know what would be very perfect to add to the gallery for like households? Um, how old they are. Because that would be better. You know, Liam Nelson, you look right, you look close enough to the one in bit life. Going with you. Going into this household. Move in. There we go. You're welcome. There we go. Perfect. Ah. One year poggies. One year poggies. Thank you so much for the resub for one heckin' year, Hobie. I really appreciate it so, so much. Yeah, like actual ages, like how old they are, like young adult, adult, elder, child, teen, like, you know, like that, like the age stages, but on the gallery. So you can like filter everything out much easier because there's literally millions of Sims in the gallery that it's so hard to, you know, Fine, which one is one? Because it's so weird because half of the children look like adults based on how they look and also the presets that people put on them. It's insane. Like crazy insane. But I have you go ahead and propose romantically. For some reason, I it gave me my reset today. Uh, It said it was tomorrow. Mm. It sometimes does that. Ma'am, wake up. You have a proposal to do. Are you going to end up alone again? Ma'am. Ma'am. Come downstairs. You're doing the uttermost today. Calm down. I know you just got divorced, but we got things to do. Chop, chop. It shows that at the top corner. Wait, what does? The, um... How old they are. I hope one day we can get actual ages. That would be lovely. I would love that actually. You know what? I can cheat the relationship. Duh. 
I want to make you a uh, 70, 67, 88. Oh, yeah. Filtering is what I mean. Good reputation. Oh. This is our second spouse of this generation. I cannot believe. Wait, what if I do I have it on short lifespan? I'm pretty sure that I do. I do. Okay, good. I have it on short lifespan. We are oh, we're still an adult. Oh, perfect. It matches what we have. Good, good. I don't want to try for a baby in the animal shit. No, thank you. Marriage. Marry me. Mary, Mary, Mary. Proposal, thank you. There we go, thank you. I appreciate it. We're gonna go ahead and actually get married right on the spot, just so that you know. Hello? Where? What? I was like, where did they go? Mistletoe kiss? Roberto? Elope. She hates fitness. She's sad. Do any of my kids have kids yet? No. I'm gonna have kids. I'm gonna have no grandkids. No one's gonna continue my legacy. Except Edwin. Except Edwin. Edwin's the only one. You can only count on Edwin. But Edwin, he is 16. So maybe I should age him up into a teenager. Actually, now that I think about it. I'll age you up into a teen. Why not? You a teen now, baby. I'll make you, you know, popular. Why not? Be a world famous celebrity. Now, let's go ahead and age up. Let's see what we got here. Don't go. I got beat up. Um, I really want to start a new challenge in The Sims. I don't know what to do. Any suggestions? Every lot, every lot challenge. I've been seeing people do that. I saw Dr. Gluon do that and James do that as well. I think that'd be very, very cool to do, honestly. Do every lot challenge challenge. Oh, I got kicked out. Can I beg them to let me stay? They beat me up again. What? Let her go. Oh my gosh. I'm going to end up alone with no job. At least I'm wealthy. Oh, let's buy it. Why not? Constipation. Depression. Oh my gosh. You've got to be kidding me. What? Oh, depression's good. It would be, it would seem hard, honestly. Doing every lot challenge in the game would be chaotic. Literally chaotic. I don't know what to do. It will be insane. Actually, you know what? Before we go, add you back to the household. Let me give you a makeover real quick. But you look a hot mess. Mm. Wait a minute. Okay. But I say go for it, honestly. I mean, depend. Like, don't you have all the packs, though, Hobie? Because if you do, that's going to be a bit of a doozy. Because if you have all the packs, I think there's like 12 lot challenges. I'm pretty sure there is. I could be wrong. I think there's 12. I spend way too much money. Mm -mm -mm. Ugh. Let me tell you, these packs are expensive. But they are worth it for many different reasons, like the lot challenges. I want them to add more in, please. I wonder if there's a way you can, you can make your own custom lot challenge. There probably is already. And if there is, I'm going to test it out and give it a go because I want to see the outcome of the chaos that I can bring to my own game. But there's also the Disney Princess Legacy Challenge or another rags to riches or another good one i don't know there's a lot of challenges but then you know not so berry black widow that's true there's some good challenges out there but you can never go wrong with a good black widow or rags to riches to be honest you can never don't do any wrong 
He gave up after Gen 1. Oh my goodness. Is it that bad? <laughs> or, or no. The 7 Toddler Challenge or the A to Z Baby Challenge. Now, two less stressful ones, but equally more demanding. I forgot I had the Not So Very Safe too. Oh my gosh. I have to fix my Not So Very Safe because I've been itching to get back into it after so long of having my game being broken um because i forget to always take out my mods folder when there's a new update because i want to be a rebel and cause chaos in my own game where it explodes for no reason the seven toddler challenge had me in tears i did the seven toddler supernatural challenge when we got the vampire game pack oh yeah the um the career legacy challenge is another good one i agree I recommend that one as well. Why does he look like a whole grandpa? He looks like a whole grandpa. We'll give you a chisel jawline, why not? Oh gosh, no. He looks like Leonardo DiCaprio for a split second. You give up every time? Gave up every single, every single time? Oh my gosh. I've done the 100 baby challenge one time. No, I've done it multiple times, but successfully completed it once. Never again. That challenge is horrifying, but worth it in many different ways. Many different ways. You've done... I've done a ton of the toddler challenge. Fun and fun. Yeah, I mean, I guess it depends on what you're doing with it. I guess. I don't know. I find it nerve-wracking sometimes. Because, like, there's so many toddlers, and, like, I can't do it. I don't think, I think in the rules it says you can hire like a, not a nanny, but like a butler. Well, I did at the end. I hired a butler because I couldn't handle all the kids. I did a whole let's play and everything on YouTube. But yeah, I did the 300 baby challenge. I mean, definitely hoping you could do it the way I did it, where you could just get everyone pregnant in The Sims 4, but not take care of the kids. I literally got every single Sim pregnant moved in with the sim that was pregnant at the time to see how many kids they were having and then as soon as the baby was born i moved out and went to the next household i literally did not take a, take care of any single child couldn't do it wouldn't do it too much pressure too much chaos but honestly or you could do the decades challenge and put like a um, storytelling spin to it oh you're on 25 and the 100 baby. That's not that bad. A quarter of a way done. Good. Yeah. His haircut looks so weird. Hmm. Okay. I'll just give this one. I can't wait to see the Sims 5 version of the 100 baby challenge. Um, the game would not function properly because it would be dead. Absolutely just gone. So evaporated. So lifted. Like honestly gone. Completely just gone. Evaporated. Lifted. It would not compute. It's saying, um, error, error, please stop. I do not compute. End. Evaporated. Gone. If <laughs> my game have child support, it would be so much money to pay out. But doesn't it, does it not, does it affect all the saves? Because for some reason, for me, my MC command center is different for each save file. So, I mean, hey. And what's Clutch Living? It'll make the Dickens Challenge easier. That is also very true. Evaporate it. Gone. The Sims 5, if you attempt the 100 Baby Challenge in The Sims 5, it would be evaporated by then because the game would not handle that many children roaming around in the world. It just couldn't. You know, it's like just evaporate, just be gone. I'm out. Can't do it. Won't do it. Been there. Don't want to do it again. He looks like a farmer. You use another mod for it. I think it's SM. Oh, SMB Bills. Oh, I had that mod in my game, and then I took it out. I'm be I'm becoming more simplistic with my mods now. For some reason, I used to be mod crazy in the past, and then I stopped downloading mods because I wasn't really using them per se. I only downloaded them because people thought it was popular, and I also. Thought they added some value to my game here and there, but not always. Um, most of them did. 
I think I just wanted to make my own mods, but never knew, really knew how. So I gave up. Now this might, this might just be me, but I would love to see the Sims five, the Sims in the space pack. I've always wanted that. Like I, I loved six some from get to work, but I wanted to be able to go to space, like live there in space and travel around. Like I've wanted that for so long. You have no idea. Into the Future was great, but that wasn't space-like. I wanted to go to space. Live in space, like on the moon. Or, you know, in a rocket ship. You know, like Xenon, Z3. Xenon? What's the Game Over Challenge? Isn't that where you just get to the Game game Over in The Sims? With one Sim and see what happens? Because I saw that she was doing that a series on YouTube earlier. I would like, I would love mermaids revamp and be able to live underwater. Yes. I need that. I just put that mod pack in my game and the game bills are too expensive. I don't like it. <laughs> my Sims are already poor enough. I can't do it. I, I just, I, I don't know what to do. It's scary. I could see a space station, your Sims living in, in a biodomes. Yeah. I would love to see that. I and like your sims could like travel, like float out in space or whatever. Like they do like as astronauts do. That would be perfect. Things think of the things you could do though. The things would be crazy. Endless amount of fun. I would think. I like my sims to struggle. I mean, who doesn't? <laughs> let's make this pack let's make this next pack. Yes. I am down. I'm learning how to make um, lot traits and careers. I found the tool that I that I had uh, signed up for so long ago on how to make Sims 4 careers. And I'm making careers again. I'm testing it out to see if it works. And it does. But I'm learning again. I'm going to go simple and make elder careers. I want to make an elder kit so badly. And I think that's where I'm going to start off as and elder, elder careers, and then make kid careers next. And then like lot traits and traits and stuff. But it's it's very simple when you really think about it once you like get the gist of it, you know? What eyes are those? I use eyes from um, Sims 3 Melahonic. Is that the name of the creator? Sims 3 Melahonic, right? Sims 3 Melahonic. Yeah, that person. I download all their eyes. They're all like alpha. Shall we leave? Bye bye. Yellow, accept me. Accept me, Shella. You must accept me. You can't get rid of me. You can't leave. Mm -mm. Accept. Accept that you love our friendship. <laughs> you will love that. Yeah, I want to make some more elder careers and uh, kid careers too basically have to max out three skills and complete aspiration before they you hit game over oh on short lifespan that sounds chaotic but now i kind of want to do it though honestly oh no i need to race up oh no i think i have it i have the rish blink don't worry it's somewhere in this list of emotes i have there it is there you go but also um shella how you do I do love you, Bessie, but I just don't love yellow. Okay, sure, sure. Sure, sure. But how was your birth? I hear it went, I hope, I hope it went great. I saw pictures on Instagram. I was lurking in your stream, you know, the usual, without saying a word. Yeah. Glad that you're here. Mm -hmm. How's your day off? Wait, today's Monday. Oh, I hope you feel better, actually, now that I saw your tweet. Like, today's not Thursday. It's not Critical Role. It's Monday. Yeah. <laughs> Purple is a superior color. Um, I don't know those words, Jordy, so I don't know what you're saying. Don't know what you're talking about. Uh, I'm feeling better. That's good. That's good. I'm glad you're feeling better. Um, that's good. Because self-care is more important than streaming, honestly. Because I took a day off this past weekend because I was mentally unstable. Yes. Uh, but anyway, 
we are playing BitLife Controls Our Sims and we've gone to jail. We've been divorced. We have seven kids and we got fired from the mafia and we've been beat up several times that we have a situation on our hands where we could literally die in a split of a second. Doesn't so sound wonderful. I'm going to say surprise me. Oh, look the other way. I saw a man mugging a girl. I looked the other way. That's not great. Surprise me. <laughs> Pretend I do not see him. Uh, go for a walk. Ironically, purple and yellow are always together. Interesting. True. True. You are correct. You have a point there. Oh. While eating brunch, your husband Liam is suddenly beginning, begins to choke on a bagel. Do they not know chew your food and not swallow your food? Chew your food with your teeth, not swallow the whole... Sit and watch. I'm going to say surprise me. He's 80. Surprise. Oh, he lived. He lived. Learn how to eat your bagel, sir. I'm 63 years old. He's, se he's 67 years old. How did that get there? Mm, lies. Oh, he, he lived. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Rosie, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? Your husband, Liam, wants to take you, uh, take you to plant a tree in the forest. Why? I'm too busy. Here in my car. I'm literally just waiting to see what happens. Like, I want to, like, continue my bit life life, but I'm like, I don't know what's happening. Oh, you know what I should do? Hire a surrogate. Hire a surrogate. Someone that's young and useful. Isabel. Select her. Ask her. She agreed. Failed. Oh, my gosh. Hold up. Wrong way. I'm going to hire a surrogate. It, I'm planning to do it. Catherine. She's crazy. You're a little bit crazy. Lauren's stable, but 43. Isabel is absolutely insane, but very smart. You know, you're insane. Agnes? 22. Why not? Not me. You. Ask. Okay, good. We have a surrogate. We have a surrogate. Yay. Now we just got to age up my sim to an elder, basically. So I can have gray hair. <laughs> We're basically just at borrowed time. Borrowed time. We're an elder now. Look at us. Don't we just look pretty? I mean, purple did use, used to be my favorite color. You, good, good answer. Used to embrace the, mag the magnificent color. Listen, listen. I just simply, I don't hate the color yellow, the, the color purple. I simply just tolerate it. And you're a new follow, Rosie. Well, welcome on in. I hope your day's going pretty good. No, I don't hate the color yellow and I don't hate the color purple. I love the color yellow and I just tolerate the color purple. No, 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 no. 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 No, I didn't say anything. I will report you. Watch, just watch it happen. Watch, Jordy, watch. Mm -mm. No, it wasn't me. Wasn't me. It was my evil twin. No, you didn't. Nope. 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 Mm -mm, nope. Hey, Spring, how are ya? I will be lurking, but you always brighten my evening three. <laughs> evening three. Well, thank you so much, Blackberry Boom, for the eight month resub. Can we get some hype and some love in the chat, please? And thank you for that brand new resub. But yeah, enjoy your lurk. And I'm doing pretty good today. Thank you for asking. Sir, are you okay? He looks stressed. Oh, not pregnancy. Oh, gosh, no. I don't have time for children right now. Elder. He's old now. The yellow life is a lie. No, it's not. 
The yellow life is not a lie. The yellow is me. The yellow is my life. Yellow is me. Yellow is my life. Yellow is not a lie. Nope. No, no. All just so rude. Ma'am, are you okay? He's unwell. Anyway, we're going to age up and continue on with our life. What? Your surrogate Agnes Hamilton just texted you saying don't contact her anymore. She's keeping the baby. I'm calling the police. I'm calling the police. She said, this is my child now. I'm suing you. I won the, the lawsuit. You know what would be very great to have in BitLife? If you sue your surrogate, take the child back. I would love that so much. You, not me. What? No, you're not. You're rude. That's rude. Ugh. I hate it here. I hate it here. I want to go home really bad. Please and thank you. You're really crazy. Lauren. I have a son your age and the color is orange. Just thinking of his sunshine. Uh, I still call him every now and then. <laughs> what do you mean? Bad vibes. Well, fine. Nope. I hate it here. I want to go home. Keep it's mine. It's mine. A flute. I'm basically just vibing at this point. I'm just going to sit here and just vibe. I'm not home, or am I, or am I, am I home? Am I really home? Or am I just simply just an illusion? Mm -hmm. No, don't tweet Shella that, no. She'll simply just deny it. You can't say anything. She won't believe you. The offer, why not? No, you're not. No, no, no. Don't do it. Don't do it. I'm watching. I'm going to age up more. Try to intervene. What? The hippie lunged at me. He poked my arm. Oh my gosh. Fight back. He called the cops on me. I'm going to cooperate. I'm going to go ahead and say I'm not guilty. Ha! Not guilty. Pair it. I'm going to keep on pressing all this. Hold up. I got to go get a surrogate. Oh, gosh. I need to continue my legacy. I want to be a famous singer. Surrogate. Not interested. Proceed anyway. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to end up alone. We're going to end up alone. I feel it. I can feel it in my bones. I can feel it. I'm going to sue everybody. I'm suing. You said not to. I thought you said to it. No, I said no. No. Involve the police. Uh, well, I ended up alone. Uh, what is this? And you tagged me in it too? <sighs> Lies. All just lies nope 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 all lies you know what i can you know i can delete those clips you know you know i can delete those clips right huh hmm. uh i can't believe i'm being attacked by my own twitch chat what has come to this i don't understand what is going on? Don't you dare. <laughs> I just got back what happened. Um, I'm simply just living. That's all you need to know. And also, um, Aqua Blue Dragonfly, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day's going pretty good. We know what was said and done. Interesting. Sure. 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 
Okay. Okay, sure. Whatever, whatever you say. Whatever you say, but nothing has happened. We are simply just still playing bit life. We're 70 years old. I'm trying to find myself. Oh. Oh, I forgot. Our spouse died. He got kidnapped. <laughs> I forgot he got kidnapped and died. Oh no. Smoky Peach, thank you for the tier one sub. I really appreciate it so so much. Can we get some hype and some yellow love in the in the chat, please? And thank you. I really appreciate it so so much. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy all the emotes here in the spring squad. Cheats. Cheats some info. Oh wait, wrong way. Wrong way. Maintain sim. Kill sim. We're gonna say uh, overheating. Why not? Here we go. But yeah, our bit life life is going badly because all of our sims are dying and we're really old. We're an elder. We're on short lifespan. We are going to end up alone. Folding, folding the laundry break. Very good. I need to go and clean my laundry at some point very soon. Gonna like play some sims. Yeah, yeah. Lurk away. You love the yellow as one should. The yellow is the best color of all time. Yes. As soon as my computer arrives, I'll be playing Sims like crazy. Ew. What's your most favorite thing about the Sims that you enjoy the most? We're going to find someone young in bit life today. We're going to go very to like one cheat. No, that's too, that's too low. We're going to go 30 years old, a million dollars. First person that we see, we're going to go in and get married to this person. Proposal, rejection. We're going to say no ring this time. Rejected. What? Our stepbrother died. Oh no. This is the, we are. This is. I'm not kidding. This is the turn for the worse. And still shocking. You learn. Wait. Shocking you all to learn things. Yeah. I don't know. Sometimes I'm building. I'm in a building mindset. Other times I live, uh, it's live drama. You know, I'm the, I'm in the same way right now. I'm in like a gameplay drama storytelling type of mood right now, and it's becoming wonderfully great. Like I'm having a lot of fun playing Bit Life Controls My Sims. Like if you end up playing Bit Life, you gotta be kidding me. What are you cheated on me? Keppel counseling. Refuse to go, argue back, age up. Sure, watch. I'm just gonna keep age up until we die. What if I, what if I do this? Hold up. What if I do something? What if I do that? Woohoo, proposal, rejected, age up, cheated on you, break up. Oh my gosh, we're gonna end up alone. I just want to have one child. That's all I want. Somebody with kids and switch. 41 and 38. You got to be kidding me. What in tarnation? I will learn this all soon. And I'm and it's out of the loop. When was the last time you played The Sims though? Because we've had a lot. Like, let me tell you, we had a lot of stuff happening in The Sims lately. And it's crazy. Like, I'm still learning as... I'm still learning every single day about The Sims because we now have a pawn tool that's so brand new. Terrain tools we've had a long time. And I'm just like, a lot of things are happening. Yep, we have a, a Grim Reaper in our midst of the household. Yeah, every time that a Sim dies, the Grim Reaper shows up. Rejected. Heart disease. He stole money. I cannot catch a break. Oh my goodness. He said it's too late because he spent, he already spent it all. What? You've got to be kidding me. What is this? Of course I will. Call the police. Attend your funeral. Apologize to my 10 followers. Q 
keep aging. Just keep going. Insomnia. Oh, gosh. Sure, I will. Oh. Oh. Not guilty. Not guilty. Ha ha. And now I finally died. Jeez Louise. I was watching the new water update and I was like, ooh, nice. Yeah. The pontoon was like the best thing we've ever gotten in the entirety of The Sims. I love the pontoon. I finally died from old age. I was getting tired of the sim already. <laughs> like nothing went, nothing good was happening. Oh my gosh. I mean, we died rich. So, I mean, that's something we're 78 years old. Wait, her service was attended by her seven loving children. A witty young lady went to graduate school. I went to, to graduate from graduate school. Friends smile when remembering how she once called her son wise. That's it. We've been to prison for three years. We murdered two of our friends, had seven lovers, seven kids, joined the mafia, and we died in Ireland. I'm going to continue as a, a child. Edwin's 39. Oh my gosh. And they have no kids. What's wrong with this, this family? This family does not know the term procreate. I swear. I just want children. Oh, I want, I want to continue the legacy of my life. There we go. There we go. Derek. Perfect. Overtime. Perfect. Oh, you know, only three years in jail. What else could you ask for? More years in jail? A part of me feels like I should continue this legacy, but a part of me is like, should I start all over though? Should I do escape? Three times before I find out what a lawyer was. Yeah. I'm gonna die from old age. A part, yeah, a part of me is like, should I start a new family or should I continue on legacy? To see how far I can go. No, it's a legacy. We'll keep on going. We'll keep going. This is a legacy challenge. We'll end until, you know, it never ends. Maintain Sim, kill Sim, old age. She dies in the bathroom. <laughs> oh, hey, Grim. How you doing? How's Mama Grim? How's Papa Grim? Still see you got some ashy looking hands, but that's okay. That's all right. I can't, I can't really give you lotion because I'm broke. <laughs> oh, what has come to thee? Woe is me. Tisk tisk. Tisk tisk, set age, young adult. We are now family oriented. Perfect. Look at us. Look at us. Grown and gone. So sad that she died. Oh. Sadness. I should probably take a picture of this before she like gets evaporated. Her memories. Her teeth are in her mouth or poking out of her mouth. That's scary. Oh. Oh. Ah. Why is the bathtub in the middle of the room? You know what? I never understood why people put bathtubs in the middle of the room. I feel that's like not so great. I mean, that's just me. Let's collect this tombstone. This tombstone. Where did our mother... Who are you? Oh, Roberto. <laughs> It's you. Half sister? What you talking about? What are you talking about, half sister? Who is your father? No, I don't know. Enjoy your lark, ghost butch. Alrighty, we're sad, but we're glad now. We should now we now can leave. We now can leave this area. Oh. We have a child now. We're a microbiologist. Oh, I forgot we went to, um, university. Nursing school. Okay. Another thing I like to see is superheroes and supervillains. Really? Wasn't there like a survey for that at, at one time? We had a survey, we had a survey on that or like different options. And I know one of them was like that. 
I would love to see superheroes and supervillains. I wonder what it would be like, though, if we had it. How long does it, will it take me to become a superstar? Oh, you know what? Instead of, like, dealing with this person, I'm going to edit him. His name. To Ortiz. Easier. <laughs> Drake attributes happiness is all the way up. He's very smart. He has very much willpower. His looks are great. His health is great. I want to be able to become a singer. So I'm going to switch over to Drake. Yes. Who is Drake? Perfect. Who's your father? Honestly, I don't even know. That's what I, that's what I get for playing Sims for so long. Like, I don't know who is your father, but you're doing too much. My uncle's first house had a sink in the middle of the room because they were weird. No, they wired the plumbing wrong. Oh my gosh. That's not great. I feel it just looks, it looks awkward, you know? Yeah, we did a long, long time ago. I think when we were, I think when we were voting for, I think laundry day stuff, like years and years ago, we were uh, doing that. Yeah. I've decided to do the career legacy challenge and I'm making Miss Sim love her. Ooh! I posted a picture in Discord. Thank you very much. Looking forward to seeing that then. You should live somewhere smaller. I want to live in an apartment. You just want futuristic, futuristic stuff again? Hmm. I don't know. Me, I mean, I'm the same way. I want to live. I want to, I not live. I, I want to have futuristic stuff again. Like I loved Into the Future. But I wish it was a little bit better better you know i wish into the future was a little bit better just because i wanted extra stuff but i would love to go into the past though going into the past would be perfect now that i would love to see into the past i'm gonna evict you it's my house now into the future was my little favorite pack oh <laughs> Okay, we moved to Windenburg. We're gonna live here. We're gonna have a child. But we need to Ashleen O'Donnell. Are they not married? Hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, they are married, but you didn't take his last name. Okay. Parents, look at these some hair madoodles. They have brown hair. Cool. Ooh, an 80s. Oh, what if we had like a 70s, 80s, and 90s stuff pack? Wouldn't that be so cool? I would love a 70s, 80s, and 90s stuff pack again. But make it a game pack where we have like gameplay aspects into the mix and just create a sim. Wouldn't it be cool? Love I would love that. Never got a chance to play into the future. I like to experience it in the Sims 4. Mm -hmm. I don't play into the future as much. Cause I loaded the Sims 3 the other day and like, ooh. I don't know. I just feel like it's just not for me. Sims 3 it is, but like Into the Future wasn't really my ultimate favorite pack because of how much there was. That is not what I was supposed to type in. What? A dog? You know what? Let's, let's make a new sim. Easy peasy. New sim. You want a historical vintage stuff so bad? Like build and buy would be a dream? Yes. Yeah, like what we have for The Sims 3, the 70s, 80s, and 90s stuff pack, but make it a game pack for The Sims 4. Like we can experience like moodlets and dance clubs and all the other stuff put in The Sims 4. I would desperately love that a lot. I really would. Anything with different eras would be amazing. Yes, I agree with you 100%. Oh, I can use my new CC now. Yay! Yay! You have like a lighter skin complexion. I'm gonna give you some this. That. I love giving Sims makeovers. I love making Sims. If you could live in one 
decade, what decade would it be and why? That's the real question. If you could live in any decade, which decade would it be and why? Oh, this is so pretty. It's so pretty, but so pretty. I need to give the rest of your skin details, ma'am. Don't worry, I'll fix you. I'll give you this one. And then I will give you this one. Well, maybe this one. Here we go. Give you these dimples. Give you different eyes because your eyes are doing at her most. This is eyeshadow. Oh, it is eyeshadow. Okay, put that down a little bit. There we go. Honestly, cast is my favorite thing to do in The Sims with all the CC. Yes, I agree. Creative Sim is the one thing that I feel like I, I thrive in the most with and without CC, just because the amount of times I go into cast for the sole reason of making Sims, just for the fun of it. I may not use them, but I do create them just for fun. So, I mean, Lord knows I have enough CC. You know, there's never enough. There's no such thing as not enough CC. I should also make a video on all my sliders that I have. Because I have so many sliders in my game. I'm not going to have so many sliders. You know, the more CC, the better. Am I right or am I right? Huh? Huh? Oh, no. Oh. I also need to, like... I need to find where all these eyes are coming from because I literally do not know what folder it is in. I just don't. In a Tandy smile thing for the tier one sub for 16 heckin' months. I really appreciate that so, so much. Can we get some hype and some love in the chat, please? And thank you for that brand new sub. Where were those lip presets from? Um, Give me one second. I need to find them again. Those lip presets. If I could tell you the name. This is the one thing. The one thing I hate about custom content so much. Simply put your name in the thumbnail. Or somewhere. Because I don't know. I don't know who made it. All I know is just lip presets. Put your name in the title, so proper credit where it's due. Actually, let me just search my mods folder. Um. Oh gosh, <laughs> I have too many things in here. What? What in the world? Uh, Peyton, thank you for the two bits. I really appreciate it so so much. Thank you, thank you. I do have a reshade. Yes, I do indeed. I do. The link is in the chat if you want to check it out for yourself. It's by Ocean Sims. It should be in that mod list somewhere. At the very top. You will live in the future. But what year in the future though? What is what if I see, let's see. Lip reset. Holistic Simmer, is that who it is? No, that's the other ones. I really can't tell. It could either it's not from vi vibrant pixels. That's I that I do know. Oh, here it is. I found it. Miko Pouty Lips? Pouty Lip Slider? Oh no. Little Peaches, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty good. Yep, here it is. <laughs> it's, oh. It's this CC creator right here. The one that I just put the link in the chat. It's this one. It's this CC creator that I got the preset from. But yes, also I do have free coloring pages if you all don't know. If you love coloring and you love free things or if you're a teacher or a parent and you want your child to calm down or do something, download my coloring pages for free. Free. 99. It's worth it. All you gotta do is sign up for my newsletter and you get them in an email. Nothing for saying what we've been thinking. You're welcome. Always happy to, always happy. Say what you're thinking, Silent Storm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I knew I recognized that thumbnail. Yeah, I was like, the thumbnail is like, I know who is who. But then I have all these presets from Zerbu. Zerbu, um, 
from the Tumblr. Yeah, I got a lot of CC in my game. Yeah, also if, check your spam folder just in case if you subscribe to the email list as well. I can show you all the, the website if you want to, what it looks like, what the color pages will look like. This is my website. Hello, Ava Mac, how are you doing today? Hope your day's going pretty good. Um, but these are like the coloring pages that you'll get. There's four of them. And all you gotta do is just sign up down below right here to uh, get them. You'll get an email confirm confirmation saying you signed up, accept it, and then it'll send you another email with the free download. You'll get four of them. They're on eight and a half by 11 paper so you can print them out, color them digitally if you want to. They're all PDF format, so perfectly fine. But they're all really great. So if you want them, they're there for free. I'm just saying. <laughs> uh, and I'm glad you're doing really great, Ava. We are working on generation three of my BitLife Controls My Sims Legacy Challenge. And let me tell you, it's gone on a downward spiral very quickly. It went, it went from zero to 100 very, very quickly, but it's been great. It's been great so far. It's been great so far. Thank you for asking. I'm not gonna control you as much, so we're just gonna give you random outfits, ma'am. There you go. Change, randomize your traits. Family orientated. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and make a baby. Make a baby. Mm -mm -mm. But yeah, we just been chilling. And my game, my bit life game, is on the other side, right over there. And we now have a baby named Drake Ortiz. And honestly. <sighs> My goal is to become a famous singer, a famous singer in BitLife, but also in The Sims. That is my plan. That is my goal. Can I achieve that goal? I don't really know, but where I'm sure going to try my darn hardest to be musically talented. Wait, while well, lying on the big soft, on a big soft blanket on the floor, you notice some fun toys to play with around you. A TV remote. Yes. Your mother has been promoted to chief petty officer. What? But have you played BitLife before? If you have, let me know. Because I would love to know if you have. It's a free mobile app if you didn't know. I find it very comforting. Also, I just realized that um we are not married. You know, it's fine. You know what? Hold up. We're going to cheat the relationship real quick. You can do that with UI Cheats mod. I love UI Cheats best mod of all time 99 6 to 5 my cheats has done wonders for me you have so great i use i used to be the the way you used to be way into bit life but i haven't played in a while oh is your hand okay i don't think your arm's supposed to turn that way sir yikes I feel like I should give BitLife another go because they said they're going to be doing a major, big, big update soon, but they didn't give us a date. So I'm like, I don't know when, but they said something's going to happen. But yeah, I don't think your arm's supposed to be bending this way, sir. You got some issues. Yikes. Cat love, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty great. How's life for you? We're playing BitLife Controls Our Sims right now. I'm about to have a baby. You know what I was watching today? I was watching some random um, YouTube videos of Glee. Like 10 minutes of why Glee is blank. Like when I think about it now, Glee, if it was on today, it would have been canceled after the first season, you know? Bit life is not bit life, but Glee is so offensive, but so funny at the same time. You used to you use bit life can choose my Sims life all the time, and I love it. It's so challenging sometimes. It is, it is very challenging. Unless you like have a bunch of mods in your game, it can become very easy. But for me, I felt like I don't need mods to like go too too crazy. But I get what you're saying though. It can be a little bit challenging at times, especially with like certain things that happen 
try for Ribby in the closet. Why not? Let's go. Chop, chop. Chop, chop. This is a one bedroom. Where is the closet? Oh, right there. Ma'am. Here we go. Good. Um, but I'm glad you're doing really good. Cat love. I'm doing pretty great. Honestly, I've, I've just been vibing. I literally just been vibing these past couple of days because mentally haven't been the best, but taking one day at a time with um, everything that's happening in the world and me moving at some point and being an adult. So it, it just comes with the territory of like aging, stress. But overall, doing peachy fine right now. We're currently on, actually we're on generation four. We're going to be on gen four with BitLife Controls, our Sims. This is our family tree right now. So, it started with Gen 1 up here, or Gen 1 was right here, Marissa, and then Gen 2, Gen 3, then Gen 4. There aren't really technically any rules, per se, with BitLife Controls, my Sims. Usually, it goes off of um, whatever happens in your BitLife game, you have to try and replicate it to the best of your ability in The Sims. Like, if your character in Bit Life had a baby, try for a baby in The Sims, and then you have your baby in The Sims, and so on and so forth. Like, as you keep on aging, new things happen, um, and you have to do it in The Sims as much as possible. Like, with me, previous generation had seven kids, and I kept on having kids because my Bit Life character was just being fertile so much. I'm like, please stop having kids. I can't do it. Please stop. <laughs> Um, but that's kind of like, it's, it's just a very simple challenge, but it's a very fun challenge overall. Moving out, it's exciting, but leading up to the, leading up, it's definitely stressful. It is. Like, I found a house and I applied for it. I'm just waiting to get, like, the email and everything to see if I got accepted or anything. I haven't got anything, I haven't heard anything back yet. So I'm getting, I'm waiting until, like, Wednesday to hear it back. If I don't hear anything back, I assume I didn't get it. And then I'm going to apply for my apartment that Wednesday. And then I'll be moving by the end of this month. I'm not mentally prepared for that right now. Um, and Car Car, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? Hope your day is going pretty good. But right for me, for me right now, it's 8.23 p.m. Right now at this current time. 8.23. Wait, Jordy, do you live by yourself? Because if so, I need help. <laughs> Give me tips. Uh, uh, let's bring one. One in zero. Two days in labor. There we go. Um, But it's 2.30 for you? 2.30. Where are you from? And I'm glad you're doing really great, Car Car. I'm doing pretty great. I've just been chilling. I've been working on my VOD channel where I re-upload all of my streams to, if you don't know. If you go to youtube.com forward slash more spring sims, um, that's where I re-upload all of my Twitch streams, just in case you don't catch them live. I'm like a month behind, but you know, it's fine. Slowly uploading them as I go. But I've been working on all of the thumbnails for all the the videos and then I finished a build that I was working on stream a couple of days ago so I've just been doing that taking it one day at a time um I like to spend all my time I like to spend time with all the options in BitLife yes and you too okay okay get a cat or dog when you move out oh most definitely I'm gonna get a dog when I move out but I'm not gonna get a dog until I'm mentally and physically prepared to do that like i've been looking for a very long time like ever since we got cats and dogs that's how long i've been searching for a dog that's perfect for me and my allergies because i almost said i'm lactose intolerant which i am but i'm also allergic to dog and cat hair which is not great so i have to get a hypoallergenic pet which i'm getting a dog but i'm finding trying to find the right dog of my dreams. Wait a minute. Where did it go? Oh, 
Why is that even a button? Why not? Just do Why not? It's easier. Give me back my Ziki. Thank you. Um, love the yellow house on YouTube video. Thank you. Yeah, I uploaded. I had that YouTube short sitting in my my video thing for like months, and the original video has been uploaded months in advance, like or or months before. Like it's, I think it's been like three months since I built that yellow house. I just didn't upload the YouTube short that I made for it. So I thought, why not upload it now and see what happens? Um, so yeah, yeah. Golden doodles are also are very good to get because they're hypoallergenic. I know that Kelsey Dangerous has a a labradoodle. I think I'm pretty sure, and I know Aspen Ovard has a golden doodle i think or a labradoodle i don't i can't remember one of the two you've always wanted a saint a saint bernard or doberman or a uh, mastiff hmm. bassinet bassinet please give me a bassinet it's gonna be a crib just give me a crib okay hmm i've always wanted like a maltese or a golden doodle or um, some type of like, I don't know. I've always just wanted a dog. I didn't care what kind it was. I just wanted one. That's how badly I wanted a dog. I didn't care what breed it was. I just wanted one. Badly. Why are you crying? Don't cry, little one. I will feed you. I will change you. I will laugh with you. Not at you, but with you. And I will love you for all your days. <laughs> they're, they're large breeds. I grew up with larger dogs, but I have. I think we have a tiny teacup Yorkie. I have also wanted a Yorkshire Terrier. Or like, um, or a Yorkie Poo. Is that what they're called? I think so. I think that's what they're called, I'm pretty sure. Anyway, let's age up. So, uh, Age number two. I have a friend at two. It's preschool, daycare. Hmm. Okay, throw a tantrum. Oh, we have a dog. We have a mutt dog named Abby. Ooh, let's get a dog now. We can adopt a dog. We can adopt a dog. I'm gonna age up. Put me down now. Thank you. Age me up. Age me up. Age me up. Thank you. We're an angelic child now. Put me down. Let's go back in the cast. Even though we were there for like five seconds ago. It's fine. Oh, hold up. I had to change my keybinds now. What if I just don't have a keybind? What if I just... Or... Artery Muse. What if I do? Word Splash. There we go. That's better. Cast out full edit mode. Aw, so cute. You love baby Rat Rylers. They're so cute, in my opinion. Yeah, they're cute. They're cute. I know Kay Kay Kayla has three of them. Kayla basically says she has a zoo at her parents' house. And I'm like, okay. Bought a match because the sale is ending. Smart. Always buy on sale. Sales will keep you alive. Oh, my cousin was rec uh, has recently got a burn doodle. They're really cute. Ooh. That's cute. And the Hunts, welcome to the stream. How are you? I hope your day is going pretty great. How's the world? But I'm doing pretty great though. I've been chilling. We're on Gen 4 of our BitLife Controls Our Sims playthrough. And it's become a bit of a, a downward spiral. Um, what you talking about? We don't have much in here. Devin, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day is going pretty great. How do you not have... They don't have all the breeds in here, which is so 
weird. You know what? That's close enough to the dog that we have in BitLife. I want to make your coat darker, though. It's dark. Make it tan. There you go. That's close enough. Do you use reshade in game? Yeah, I just use one preset, though. I use Ocean Sims' uh, preset. It's in my mods list. It should be like the first link in that um, Google Doc link. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, I just use one for my gameplay and everything. Give me a bit of a makeover child. Oof. Those eyes. It was 350 when it was originally a thousand. That's a sale. That's what I call a sale right there. Well, hopefully the bed works out great. I do not stream daily. Um, I couldn't do it. I can't do, I can't stream daily because I physically just can't. Um, but I do stream every Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday at 6 p.m. Central Time. Um, occasionally I will squeeze in like an extra bonus stream on Wednesdays, but early in the morning around like 10 a.m., which we're actually going to have an early stream this Wednesday where I'm going to make some custom content and also do some illustrations on stream this Wednesday at 10 a.m. But yeah. All the information I always post, I always post it in Discord, just in case if you want to familiarize yourself with more stuff that's happening on stream, or just in general. But yeah. Um, but that's my stream schedule. Uh, Tommy Lillian dog. Oh, that's nice. Stress, very stress, but trying to keep going. You know, me and you both. Me and you both. I'm trying to, I'm stressed, but trying to keep it, you know, together one day at a time. Oh, that's not that bad. That's a, that's a good rating with that many reviews. Good. I have bought a back massager for my back and my neck and everything. The reviews were great and I'm glad I bought it because it works wonders. You love art streams? So do I. I love art streams. They're my favorite. I'm thinking of actually turning my illustrations that I make and then put them in the Sims, like make them as custom content, because why not? It's just simply a matter of fact, it's like resizing things, but I want to turn my art into um, custom content. He looks so cute. I love toddlers and the Sims they are so adorable, but yet they wreak havoc for no reason. Now, my child has black hair. I'm going to give you the newest swatch. There you go. He looks so cute. I don't know. Children are great, but... Yeah, we'll just go with that. Um, Where is the new outfit that we got from Cottage Living? I want to use the backpack one. Um... No, those are the suspenders, which is also very cute. Where are the... Wait, where did it go? Am I going Lulu? You know, it's fine. I don't need it. I don't need it. Yeah, well, it's not a portable... It's a portable massager. You just have to plug it into the wall, basically, to um make it work. And also, buy space to get it. Bye, Space Cadet. How are you doing today? I hope your day's going pretty good. How's your life doing today? Oh, it's not a full body outfit. It's a it's a top. That's what I wanted. There we go. It's cute. Those freckles are so adorable. They really are. Uh, I have one, so I'm tempted to get those Lazy Boy mas massage chairs with the leg massage. I was tempted to get those too, but I'm like, I don't want to pay as much. The one I got was like $20, and it, it's, I like it, honestly. I have had no complaints. I mean, it automatically shuts off when it's like, it gets to a point which is like normal, but so far, I, I like it. And you're welcome, Karkar. Always happy, you know, to share some love with the mods and also uh, make some videos. 
I think I have a video going out tomorrow, I'm pretty sure. I just have to sit down and edit it um, tonight. And then it should be good. Um, okay, that's fine. <gasps> yeah. I, let me see if I can find a link for you. Because I say it, it looks good. Um. Um, but yeah, honestly, $20 not that bad. What do I have in my cart? Oh. I was gonna buy a controller for the- I was gonna buy a PS4 controller so I can get the PS Now subscription on my PC so I could play Until Dawn and all those, like, other games I've been wanting to play for so long but couldn't. Um, but I'm gonna wait for that. Is this it? Oh. No, not $20. It was $31. Never mind. $31. But it's wonderful. Here's a link to I. That's what I got. Yeah. $31. That's great reviews. It's like four and a half stars, 389 ratings. So, I mean, not that bad. Yeah. Alrighty. So, let's go and get your eyeballs back, sir. Get your eyeballs back in your head. He looks like a brand new person. When you put your Sims in new, in a, with a new contacts, it's like, wow, they look different. I love it. They're catfishing you. Catfish? You know what? Now thinking of, when I was on TikTok today, I keep on getting like this like TikTok of a sound from fish hooks. And I'm like, now I want to rewatch Fish Hooks for no reason because I love um, Chelsea or Chelsea. I don't know what her name is, but um, I want to watch Fish Hooks again. And my gym partner's a monkey and all the old cartoons I used to watch as a kid, you know, the usual stuff. Yeah, the use, the use. Okay, there we go. He looks dandy. I can't wait for him to sing for days. So our dog name is Abby, which is very cute. Abby. There, go. there we go. Hey. Old cartoons are the best. Fish hooks is where it is at. Could do no wrong with fish hooks. Just saying. Spring Sims love, Spring Sims love, Spring Sims love, Spring Sims love. Kayla Kapow, thank you so much for the resub for four heckin' months. Can we get some hype and some love in the chat, please? And thank you for that brand new resub. Thank you, thank you so, so much. Oh, and I was re I was watching the new Tales of Arcadia Bay. No, I was watching the Tales of Arcadia, the movie, the final movie, and it was really good. I was very pleased about that. Hype, hype, hype. Yeah, can we get some hype and some love in the chat, please? And thank you. A brand new up. So we are now three years old. I'm going to keep on aging up very, very quickly. I and mean, I broke it. Broke it. Up, up. Uppities, uppities. Uppities, uppities. I pet my dog. Conversation with our father. Our mother. Oh, not this again. I swear. I don't... With BitLife, I do not like the eye exam. It's both. So there's Tales of Arcadia, Wizards, Trolls, and Three Below, which are all TV shows on Netflix. And then they have Tales of Arcadia. I forget what the last one was titled, but it was the movie that just came out this year. Um, so it's both. Three shows that lead up to the movie at the end. Oh gosh, this eye exam is awful. Oh, here it is. There go. I love Tales of Arcadia. It's like the best series I've ever played and more played, watched in my entire life. And I'm thinking of rewatching it again. BitLife, the eye exams in BitLife are awful. I fail every time, not unless if I have it up close into my face. Because let me tell you, those glasses be looking awful in BitLife sometimes. Okay. Your friend Sorze asks you to go to a costume party as with you to dress. Wait, 
with her dressed as a bunny, I'm in. I didn't enjoy, but she did. Well, that's just sad. Still an infant. Primary school. Ugh, can make friends now, finally. Now, I don't think I can do... I can do instruments, but I want to do like a voice thing. Which I can't do until I'm like eight, I think. Eight years old. Be appreciative, let's go. It's Shanghai. My dog died! We just got our dog! Oh my gosh, my dog just died! I refuse to let it happen in Sims. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Oh my gosh. I'm not really sure when Umbrella Academy is supposed to come back though. I know that with um with Netflix, they literally said in a statement that if you don't have if you're not vaccinated, you can't work. <laughs> they literally said that. They said all Netflix shows, like all Netflix actors, have to be vaccinated in order to work. So if they're not vaccinated, they don't work. So I don't know when it's going to come back at some point. Uh, I do it and I will follow. Oh, well, thank you so much, Valerie, for the follow. Really appreciate it so, so much. Oh my gosh. Oh, you finally got back to the computer? Nice, nice. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They literally said if you don't, if you don't get vaccinated, you can't work. I'm not even kidding. I'm just gonna like remove from household. We'll just do that and let you just run away. Oh, I'm gonna reset you. Can I say you? Can you just go away? Some commands. Hmm, we're just gonna say that he died and went to another family. Yeah, we'll just say that. Yeah, we'll just say that. No, I'm not going to. Oh, no, no, no. I could not. Uh-uh. Could not do it. I love dogs too much. I can't let them go. We just say we simply moved into a new household. Yeah. Oh, you plan to do the new show? Oh, not this time. I already said, oh, wow. Oh, oh. And Garrett, welcome back to the stream. How are you? I'm going to see. Let's see. Okay. Remove. Reset object. <laughs> object. Let's see, some cheats, no, relationships, no, commands, move sim, we did that. Oh, I guess we just have to wait until, you know, they start moving out. That's fine. Eh, what can you do? You got a new phone this weekend? Ooh, what kind of phone did you get? Anything interesting, good? Mm, care to share? Okay, so we're seven years old in bit life. And we, I think we can now, I think, no, we have to age up one, one more year. Okay. I think now that we're eight years old, we can now take voice lessons in BitLife. Good. Eight years old. Yeah. We're on our way to stardom. I'm so excited. On our way to stardom. Oh, 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 stardom time. Oh yeah, I'm gonna make my a child, don't worry. Don't worry, I will. I was just like making sure I had everything already according to plan. Oh. I wish you could pick up these Sims, but you can't. Oh my gosh. One of these days, one of these days, you'll be able to pick up your Sim like you do in The Sims 3 and, and 2. Back in the eon olden days, you could turn on move objects and pick up your sim and move them and drag them around like they were objects because they were. Let me give you this bed. Why not? This one over here. It's also very dark in this area. Whoever built this house, it needs some work because I literally cannot see a thing in this house. Saucer lights, they're cheap and they are worth it worth it you got a new iphone 12 pro apple watch apple product for first apple product in six years Get that. i like what i like i like what i see very good very good very good and welcome back karen welcome back and also vol vol lopez welcome to the stream how are you 
Hope your day is going pretty good. We're gonna get a computer. That way we can probably start doing stuff on the computer for social media. And then I think that's all we need, pretty much. We're not gonna live much in this house anyway. Oh yeah, that's a good question. What computer did you get? Not computer, but what color did you get? And see, command center, said A, it's a child. There we go. Ah, music lover. Oh, it was meant to be. It was meant to be. To be a good old fashioned music lover with your blonde bleached eyebrows. You know what? New makeover. I swear, it's a never ending task of going in and out of casts. Honestly. Create a Sims the best. So I wouldn't really complain. Cast is where the true a true love lies. I love gameplay every now and then. But let me just tell you. Cast is great. Look. Huh? What is this? Wait a minute. Okay. Not important. Okay. What happened to his hand? You know, not important. It's fine. Who cares about a hand? Who needs hands when you have your feet? Who needs hands when you got your feet to feed you instead? Hands are overrated. When you really think about it. Unnecessary. Just claw the just causing your pain and causing chaos for no reason that you just don't really need them. Sims don't need them. They have their feet for it and their mouth. Hmm. Yeah, I need to go into my mods at some point in my life and figure out where are these eyes located. I'm literally not kidding. I don't know where these things are in my mods folder, but I'm going to find them and I'm going to delete, delete all of them because there's too many that I do not use. And that is all of them. I don't use any of them except custom content contacts. Lips for days. I'll tell you lips for days. Oh, when she moved, can you do a real life shell challenge? A real life shell challenge? You mean like renovating the whole, the whole thing? That was already my plan. Once I move, I'm gonna renovate each room if I'm allowed to. And you know, what I realized, if I'm not allowed to paint a wall, I'm just gonna put a lot of yellow accents in the room to substitute the fact that I can't paint. Only if, only if I can't paint. If I can paint, best believe I'm gonna paint the whole room yellow again. Best believe it's going to happen. But if I can't, I'll just do, I'll just do yellow accents around the wall and around the room just to substitute it. Because, I mean, honestly, I ain't trying to get sued or break my security deposit. My first adult team thing. So, just so you all know that now. Just so that you all know that now. Things could change. Drastically. That's also the other thing. What, what I've learned is that with new apartments, sometimes they don't allow you to paint or at peel and stick wallpaper or anything. And I'm just like, why? What's like, if you're gonna live there, I need to have my personality in there or I'll be mentally depressed. Like if I can't like add my own personality in my own house that I'm paying for, I will be depressed. So I'm like, yeah. Oh, I'm in hot weather, thank you. Cause I would have not known. Oh yeah, there will be plants for sure. There'll be plants for sure. Yeah, I can't paint or anything of mine. It's so sad. But then again, I can't understand. But then I'm gonna tell them like, I'll just get it professionally painted, which I would. And I feel like then they'll understand. But I'm like, I don't really know. Cause watching YouTube tutorials and everything helps a lot. But I'm like, I'll have it professionally painted and I'll get it painted back when I move out. If I move out, which I would probably never would move out, to be honest. I don't know, some people are just so stingy. It's like, I know what looks good, but 
Let me tell you, some apartments have some ugly black backsplashes and it's so annoying. I'm like, why did you pick this one? It's ugly. Don't use that one. Please change it. It's weird. Um, everything is beige and walls covered. Yeah, luckily your furniture we picked out are grays and cool colors so it balances out. That's good. And what's with the beige? I don't know. Beige is... Mm -mm. No beige for me. Cannot do the beige. There we go. I don't know. It's like, it's beige and wallpaper everywhere. And then it's like this gray, green tinted tile backsplash for your kitchen. And I'm just like, no. Just no. Don't even try. And like the first thing I'm like, can I cover this up at in any shape or form? Because if I can, I will do that in a heartbeat. Best believe it. You're in here designer IRL, so it's kind of mad not being able to paint anything. Yeah, it really is. I was watching a bunch of like Mr. Kate videos and Lone Fox videos on like renter friendly things that you can do when you can't paint. I know there's a video out there by Mr. Kate that she made a while back ago that I think they're like, uh, like 10, I think 10 um, things you can do in your apartment if you can't paint the walls. And I have to look back at that video and see what I can do. Because that way I can be creative without breaking any rules. I think if you just bring them out, it's my friend. You're not gonna do much here. Oh, what, what happened to your eyebrows, sir? Your eyebrows are white. Are you Santa Claus? Yeah. I've always wanted to be an interior designer, but simply I am not. I just learned from, from other people. Mr. Kate and Lone Fox and other things and Pinterest and also The Sims. But one day I'll be a lovely interior designer slash YouTuber. Anyway, I think I'm going to actually leave it off here for today on a good note because one, we're eight years old and two, we are just simply doing great. We're eight, generation four, living our life like it's golden and vibing. But can we get the lovely clip of the day today? Would love to see all of that. Thank you. <laughs> But yeah, honestly, I, I don't know. One of these days I'm be like, can I just decorate your entire like, you know, floor? Like if I, if I ever had the job of being an interior designer to design each apartment room, I would. Yeah, I was like, that one doesn't work, but this one works. Alrighty friends, we got a clip of the day. Oh, this one, oh, this one. This one, let me tell you, chaotic. I don't know what it is, but with Fall Guys, I'm literally the worst person at Fall Guys. I'm terrible at it. I saw that Kayla, Dan, Sasha, and Zeus were playing it, and I'm like, wait a minute. I'm terrible at Fall Guys. I literally just keep on falling and falling and falling and more falling. But what can you do? It's Fall Guys. Wait, what? Move out of my way, losers! I just simply don't know what to do. I mean, I was doing great with this oh one. Oh my gosh, no! Move. Oh my gosh, what in tarnation? Move! I was disappointed that day. Move out of my way, losers! Or was I? No, I was. It's just so sad. I'm like, why? Oh They're my always gosh, no. Move. They're always in my way, asking for trouble. But as soon as you get down somewhere, it's like, well, oh my gosh, what incarnation? Move. It makes you want to rage quit a lot of things. At least for me, it does. I want to rage quit Fall Guys so badly because I can't win. I've never gotten a crown in in a uh, Fall Guys before because how difficult it can be. It's like, why? I want to rage quit 
Like, I'm not, I don't get as angry as I did when I played Flappy Bird. That's a whole different type of, type of rage. Flappy Bird rage is like toxic rage. Fall Guys rage is like, you know, manageable. But I'm telling you, this is... I just think I just got to practice a little bit more with uh, Fall Guys to get better at it. But I'm like, yeah. Yeah. Flappy Bird was a choice that we simply acknowledge and we ask ourselves, what was the reason? What happened? Because F Flappy Bird was just a lot to handle. Like, literally a lot to handle. <laughs> but anyway, the quote of the day shall be, my life is like an ashy cracked up potato. Yes. Me with Fall Guys and, bi and Bit Life and Flappy Bird. My life is like an ashy cracked up potato on a Sunday morning when you laid out there for five days and you ask yourself, why is it so ashy cracked up? Because you left it outside for five days on a Sunday morning. That's why. Um, <laughs> anyway, Dominic Bunny, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope your day's going pretty really good. But thank you all so much for being here. I appreciate the company. We're going to go show some love over to my good friend Zephyrin today. Who I think she is. She's currently building right now for a decades challenge. So if we're looking for a new challenge to play, I think you all would definitely love the decades challenge for sure. Honestly, I think you really would. But my friends, thank you all so much for being here. I really appreciate the company as much as always. Tomorrow, we are going to be playing some more Sims, but I'm going to be renovating one of your builds in The Sims 4. So that should be pretty fun, actually. But yeah, hope you all enjoyed today's stream as much as I did. I will see you all tomorrow at 6 p.m. Stay safe. Don't be a stranger and always love the color yellow as always. We'll see you all later. Bye-bye. Do 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 boop. La 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 la.